Thank you for tuning in to TalkWad.com, the world's fastest growing internet radio network. Please check out all the other great shows on www.talkwad.com. Yo, round two. Good evening to all who are listening. Welcome to the program. I'm Nicholas Nassos, along with uh, uh, George Serentopoulos. Yes, and Gio. Gio. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Good, welcome to the show. It's our Thank first timer. Thank you timer. so much. So, so uh, excited. Yeah, are you? I am. Uh, how excited? So excited. Oh, really? Yes. Can you do she something? She looks excited. excited. Uh, can am. you do something exciting for us? <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> Maybe nice. Later. <laughs> Strip, baby. No. Oh, no. no, no, no. Maybe one that we have to save for later, right? Not okay. Right yeah. <laughs> well, all right. Uh, how's everyone's weekend, George? Mine was pretty good, actually. Yeah? What'd you do? Worked. <laughs> Worked. Yes. Worked and drank and... Drank. How much did you drink? Drank. Set because, wait, drank. You, know you know what? Over the weekend was the uh, night parade in Ebor. Did you go? No, I did not get to go. Oh. I really loved to would have got loved to go, but what I happened? didn't get a chance to go. Why? I was stuck working. Oh, I'm stuck working. How about you? Did you get to go? Uh, to the night parade? Yeah. No, I did not. You, you had to think about that? I did have to think <laughs> about it. I actually forgot what I did this weekend. Oh, wow. It was that great. Really? Yes. Did How much did you drink? Just a tad bit. Yeah. Who doesn't drink in this town? Um... <laughs> The Pope. Hmm. The Pope. I won't answer that. Which they need a new one by now. Uh, yeah. Is that, is that white smoke or black smoke coming out of that chimney? <laughs> I think it's when he dies, it's black. No, I thought if... Oh, is it? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not Catholic. I wouldn't know. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> I try. What did you do this weekend? Uh, I, I got drunk. You did? Yes, I Go did. Go figure. <laughs> Go figure. Nick get right drunk, there. that wouldn't happen. Okay. No, not me. Not you. Not you. <laughs> uh, I went out with a couple buddies. We went to, uh, where did, what did we do this week? Let me you know guess. what? The Rack. The Rack. That's right. We went there. We went to the Rack with uh, a, a buddy, a couple buddies of mine. Uh, actually, I got to shout them out because I promised them. I got with Matt and Jeremy. You got to meet Jeremy. You like Jeremy. Yeah. Yeah. Jeremy, for you, yeah. He's, you look he's like tall. Bradley Cooper? No, yeah, he looks yeah. more. But he's tall. He's dark haired. Uh, I know Jeremy's a good song by by uh, Pearl Jam. Oh, is it? For sure. I I don't know. That. I could sing Why it, but I don't. I don't, th- I don't <laughs> think my <laughs> voice should be. <laughs> I would love to hear that. Uh, as you prob- bring it up, as you probably guessed, uh, the two wonderful people who usually are here are off and on vacation. Uh, that explains Louis- the room we have over here. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> George, uh, Louis, Louis, and uh, uh, Nassau are both on vacation uh, as of right now, and they're probably sitting uh, at home getting ready to go to Chicago because that's uh, or getting ready to go to Chicago. When are they leaving? Midnight? I have no idea. Probably yeah. one in the morning. Yeah, something like that. Well, uh, for the next couple of weeks, they're going to be gone, so uh, we're going to miss them. But I, I think they're going to be calling in, maybe say hello. Oh, they should. Yeah, they should. <laughs> and, but yeah. but we've got we've got Amy for the next couple of weeks. We do. Huh? Yes, we the do. Next couple of weeks. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I, I, right. yeah. Who I knows? It was just a one-time thing. But... If, if oh no. Okay. Uh, right. if, no, there's if, no if, such thing as one-time thing here. Oh. No, not. I not came just station. to visit. No, I'm stuck <laughs> here too. <laughs> yeah, George You're is stuck. stuck. George is now the, the, the next. Uh, uh, always the fill-in now. Yes. And and yes. Good. he's a good fill-in. But I, get, I might end up being the permanent fill-in, so you never know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, uh, well, the way we go, we, we might just uh, take this show, the three of us. Take there you go. Who All needs right. Louie and Nassau? No, Chat. kidding. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that was a joke, guys. <laughs> <clears throat> but uh, the other person who is going to be joining us uh, soon will be Joe. Joe uh, is the other fill-in usually, and he's a little bit late. Like a, like a typical Greek, he's late. Yeah, I mean, Greeks are always late. 
I know. You tell us that eight thirty, we show up at at nine thirteen. Yeah, it's a, it's it's a Greek thing. <laughs> it's kind of like Italian, actually. You're Italian, right? I am Italian. Yeah. Yes, I yeah. Am. I know. What part of Italy are you from? Sicily. Sicily. Yes. Ooh. Here, um, can can, can we you hear, hear me? Her? Can you hear me now? She, we Palermo. Can hear her, right? Wait. She's perfect on that. Okay. Good. Sorry, we're, we had trouble with the uh, penis microphones. <laughs> you just love the penis All right, can I get a different mic okay. because I can't stand looking at this thing anymore? Oh, my God. Because of Nick? Uh, okay, with okay. The Anyhow. <laughs> Anyhow, what did I say? Well, I don't know what I said. <laughs> you are out of control. Yeah, you just out of control. whatever comes out, out of your of ass. Mouth. Yeah. Did you go to any strip clubs this weekend, by the way? I did. You did. Yes, I went to, Ow, Jesus. Jeez. You have to hit me? <laughs> That's hard. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry. It's not a lot. I did. I went with a buddy of mine. We went to Mons Venus, and we shouldn't have, but we did. You shouldn't have. Thanks for the invite. <laughs> what? Thanks for the invite. Uh, um, why, Nick, I, I thought you were you working. Why him out? Yeah, what the hell, man? You're okay. always working. You're working at the gondolier. I can make a time. Right. Place, starts, the place closes at 3, doesn't it? Yeah, I... Well, more than that. Right? All right, we close more at than 10. That? 6 a.m.? <laughs> 6 a.m.? 8 a.m.? Something? You never know. What are you doing? I don't know. What am I doing? <laughs> Which one did you go to, by the way? Mons, and then we went to uh, Penthouse, I believe. <laughs> hmm, okay. Yeah, well, uh, we have a, kind of a packed show today. Uh, we we are doing, a little bit later on in this show, uh, we're, we have to do, get to the top story so we can get all this over with. That way we can actually get to the Super Saint Valentine's Day special. Yes. Yes. That's my favorite because part. Yes. We are talking about, <laughs> we're going to talk about. Sex, sex, sex. Sex, obviously, <laughs> because tomorrow is Valentine's oh, yeah. Day. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, uh, I mean, mm. uh, by the way, speaking of Valentine's Day, uh, dates, George, are you going on a date? Mm-hmm. Yeah, with my job. <laughs> oh. And that sucks. Afterwards? No. You never know. You never know who you might meet at work. You're going out like that uh, same the... day. Who are you going to meet at work that same day? You never know. You're going to die. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably end up on the beach or something afterwards. Uh, on the beach? You, you, know what? you could. I the do beach live in a very romantic beach, thing, so. isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, get a girl. Get, uh, yeah. A little yeah. Bit of romance. Wow. A little bit. A little bit. Maybe. We'll see. And what about you? No dates. I thought I was taking you out. Maybe. Mm, maybe. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Is is someone? I wonder if someone's listening. <laughs> I don't know. I hope so. <laughs> if they out. are, you know, <laughs> if they are listening, to shout out to all my friends that are listening. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> Please listen to us. Oh my god. <laughs> We're not desperate. We're just We're... talking to ourselves. Here. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. That's great. Uh, if you have any we'll questions first time or comments you. later on, you can also call in at eight one three six. Three nine talk us eight one three six three nine eight two five five. Um, <clears throat> as soon as Joe gets here, whenever he gets here, um, I know he's busy right now doing this and that and blah blah blah. He's an attorney, so he's always busy. Yeah, busy doing what? I don't know. Nothing. I, I have a fe- feeling he had a he had a friend, maybe a friend uh, tonight. Friend of a friend of a friend. Yeah. Um, who? I don't know. He had a friend with. He he said something about a friend earlier, and it was like, "Oh, can I bring a friend along?" And I said, oh, "I don't know." <laughs> he didn't say it was a female or male. The stripper. The stripper. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in love with the stripper. <laughs> Pick up the stripper, Joe. Oh bring her in. God. <laughs> Man, we are yeah, obsessed right. with strippers tonight. No, I, I, I don't you know have been talking about strippers all night Hello? tonight. Yes, oh, you have. Thank you for telling our audience out there. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> It's all good. Yes. All right. <clears throat> so uh, the Grammys were this week, or over the weekend, I should say. Yes, Did they anyone were. watch it? Um, I only watched part of it. Yeah, Adele. I watched Adele. Adele. What was up with her dress? Did you see yeah. it? Yeah. Um, I, I saw Holy dress. smokes. Yeah, did you see this? Look at this. It looks like an oven mitt. It, it didn't look like, like an oven mitt. so hideous. Oven mitt. It looks like my grandmother's <laughs> thing, apron. That I know. Thing is... it, and it looks like something that... You should put in the oven. <laughs> and like an upside down pineapple cake. I don't, I don't she, know. I don't think she'd fit though. <laughs> Poor old Del. <laughs> it just does. Uh, the thing well, is horrible. It is. But did you hear what happened on stage? No. What happened? A man uh, was arrested after attempting to upstage Adele at the uh, Grammy Awards. Uh, now faces possible trespassing charge for his latest celebrity interaction gone wrong. Ooh. What do you mean upstage her? I don't know. I uh, uh, somebody uh, went on stage, and uh, the Hollywood Reporter 
said that, uh, which first reported his arrest, uh, that uh, he was allowed into the uh, show despite having a ticket. Uh, video does show that uh, he did start to speak before Adele did, or before she accepted the Grammy on the telecast, but uh, he was shooed away by security. Hmm. Now, hmm. How did he even get up on the stage to speak? That I don't know. Yeah, that I, mean, what, <laughs> I have uh, no clue. What, really? Right. Sorry. Hello, we're doing a show here. <laughs> Hello. Oh, we're on the air. Are you <laughs> dress and how horrible it looked. Okay? I, I, I mean, we're, we're I'm sorry. on the air. Over there. What's going on here? I'm, I'm, you uh, know, I was. I got, I got how everyone did, back get, home. Like, how did somebody after all and, that security, especially with that ex-cop killer that was out there in LA, um, a, uh, how how did someone get on stage and about to speak and then security threw threw them off? I have no idea. <laughs> Who knows, man. The thing with that guy with the cop killer, I'm I'm still wondering how the house caught on fire. Oh yeah, like, did you like see I swear that? to God, it, it had to be from a scene from a movie. It, it was. I mean, it was like a Bruce Willis movie. I can't even think of. Police the name. apparently scored the uh, mountain for days, and he, he was in that bunker or whatever. Yeah, yeah, that uh, in Bear Lake, something like that. Yeah. In wait, wait, wait. What Bear happened? Bear like, I don't watch the news because it's just depressing. <laughs> of course so you don't. I yeah, we've don't, noticed but... that already. <laughs> Shut up. Well, so, uh, police uh, scored mountain peaks for days using everything from uh, bloodhounds to helicopters that are, were equipped with high-tech equipment. Uh, the, the manhunt went on, and it ended yesterday, though. Uh, the, uh, he apparently shot himself before but before he did that. He apparently, uh, excuse me, he uh, shot, uh, gunfire was exchanged between officers. He all together, four people were dead, but and including the uh, the gunman. So he was an ex cop apparently, and the ex cop would wanted revenge on all the other police officers because he didn't get his pay or something like that. That that was the whole story. Yeah, uh, boring. Ex ex cop. No, <laughs> you want to bore him, dude? <laughs> no, but seriously, I mean, really, I, I, an ex cop gone bad. Jesus. Uh, it's it's happening more and more in the in this world. Uh, it's it, you know, that and it's just yes. Yeah, so I'm a cop, but I'm gonna go bad later. So uh, I'll just I'll, I'll arrest people and then. Do I you won't. think most <laughs> cops are bad? Uh, Do you agree if we're with talking that? about Chicago cops, yeah, it's it's corrupt. Chicago <laughs> cops? <laughs> like, what about Canada? Florida cops? Now Florida, they just they just want to pull the, the DUIs over. Uh, yes, they Heck love yeah. their DUIs here. This is the, like the biggest DUI town. It, it really is, got, is. How many people out there have DUIs? If you have one, call in. I would like to know talk. this. <laughs> yeah. I really would. <laughs> Honestly, okay. because it just, it, I mean, DUI city, uh, it, it is. I mean, I, I i know someone. How many people do you know right now with a DUI? Tons. I, I mean, I. I just, like a number. Just throw out a number. I, I can't. The number's too hot. <laughs> so, <laughs> like, <laughs> so bad. I know and not just one, a, no. like three. Yeah, yeah, I know someone who has three or four. Right now. <laughs> Me too. Mm. <laughs> Apparently, we both know the same person. Yes, we do. <laughs> we good thing, it's a good thing I'm an angel. Yes. Mm -hmm. But you, you you just moved here, so. Um, yeah, give it time. <clears throat> give it a week. Yeah, give it a week. Give it a week. <laughs> give it a week. And we'll... <laughs> well, we, I've been here a year. <laughs> a year? Yeah. Well, then... Have you really? Yeah. Already? Yeah. I didn't know that. And good for you. Just good for knock you. on wood. That you yeah, didn't, uh, don't have a DUI along with this one. I do not have a DUI. No, knock she on wood. Exactly. Naughty, naughty. And no, I mean, I mean the, the way you drink. <laughs> oh, that's so messed up. I barely uh, that's just, drink. That's just Florida, okay. man. That just oh. goes without saying. Oh, I'm sorry. What was that one time you came over to the uh, my place and you started drinking and we drank for a week? You have to. We hear did. We a drank week for straight. one week straight, literally, with my roommate and and this wonderful lady next to me. Yes. And so it was just, a week straight. Yes, it just really was. We woke I mean, up. We how much? Had a how many bottle bottles of wine, wine did we go <laughs> get, go through? <laughs> a lot. A lot. Did we? Oh wow. Twenty. No, more than that. More than that. I mean, it was a week. Twenty bottles. That's true. Twenty bottles will get you That's through. That's like a, a day, right? Uh, not even. <laughs> It'll get you through at least four hours. Oh my God, with you, <laughs> yes, because you're less. Yes, you missed this. It was a lot of fun. It was uh, you, me, my roommate, and mm -hmm. uh, uh, your friend Courtney. Your friend Courtney. Your friend Courtney. Courtney. No, your friend Courtney. <laughs> okay, all right. All right. Yeah, we both don't like her. She's 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 gone. She's she's, she's out a of picture vivid now. Of yeah. our imagination. Not a good friend. <laughs> yeah, and she threw me out of the car. 
<laughs> she did. While it was going. <laughs> that was awesome. Just threw you out, Just, ooh, moving car and all. Get out of my car. I think it was right in front of the church and she told you yes, that you needed to go right inside. Right in front of my church, right. no less. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's you like, go pray. pray. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Is it a Greek church you at least or something? Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Man, right. uh, that's funny. Well, uh, surprising news over the weekend as well. Uh, the Pope resigned. He did. Uh, yeah, this is his last hurrah, I believe. Correct. Yes, I would believe so. Hmm. Yeah, um, it's the first time it's ever happened. Ever and in, uh, in the Catholics uh, millennia. Yeah, since. Uh, he ever was elected? I don't think it's ever. Been, I don't think a pope has ever resigned. <clears throat> I don't think so either. <laughs> They've either died, Whatever. and that's about it. Do you, did you know anything about the pope? Not really. <laughs> Is that horrible? <laughs> Is that really bad of me that I don't? Uh. Yeah. Don't even make that face. I mean, just don't even do it, please. Just don't. And uh, you have the Pope hat and everything? No, I don't. Ah! <laughs> Shut up. I think Shut Nick up. has it. He's just trying to put the blame on someone else. Yes. yes I know. <clears throat> I know. Next. Uh, also, next. <laughs> yes, keep <Yeah>. nexting. <laughs> next. Next. <laughs> All right. Carnival cruise lines are in trouble. Have you ever been on a cruise? No, I actually haven't. Have You've you? never been on no, a cruise? No, I haven't. You have never been on a cruise? That's insane. No. That's insane. Except awesome. for that big thing in greece going to the islands but that's not a cruise is it that's no a that's ferry. a ferry boat and and that but <laughs> that ferry is huge yeah and it takes like nine and a half days just to get to the icaria yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> really i can't Honest believe you've never been on a cruise no i've never been N- neither have i like? so don't you know i'm not you've never been one. on a cruise and, and you're 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 like you're yelling at me yeah what it's just easy to yell at you dude <laughs> Have you ever been on a cruise? Yes, a million of them. Oh, really? Yes. Tell us. It's like the best vacation ever. What kind of cruise was it? What do you mean? What kind of cruise was it? No, I haven't been on. I have not been on a single cruise. Amazing. I'm sure they are. That's a perfect cruise for you. The blues cruise. No, you (laughs) would fit right in on that one. And I'm sure you do too. (laughs) Maybe. Maybe I wouldn't doubt uh, it. Jeez, <laughs> the but drinking it is, we do in this so place. much fun. That's all you do is drink. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I mean, just drink. I mean, stumble f- back into your room. Is there good. food at least? Of course, there's food. There's <laughs> million. There's yeah, a I midnight mean, buffet. On. There's a freaking there, brunch. There's more booze, though, right? And more booze. <laughs> more booze. <laughs> how long that's all you booze? need. I mean, how long is are the cruises? Are they like days? You or? can do a three day, four <clears throat> day, five day, seven day, day fourteen really? day. Yeah. What, 14 days on yeah, a Yeah, that cruise? would be a little Jeez. ridiculous. You'd be can, dead can, 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 by can that Can we do time. a new record? Can we, can, can we put like a, pull a record on that? You, oh my God. <laughs> you'd, be, wait, you'd, be, you'd just be like, get up, drink, sit down, drink. <laughs> exactly. You'd be drunk all day long. Full, all pool, day long. full of alcohol. Yes. All day long. Oh. Oh, Nonstop. Geez. Well, apparently the Carnival Cruise Lines had their troubles. They are canceling the voyage through April aboard the carnival triumph because it apparently had some problems and and it was just left powerless in the gulf of mexico two tugboats uh we uh, tugged it back home the four thousand people on board uh rubbing tugs yeah right <laughs> um, tugging, so, tugging. some who have uh mm-hmm. told relatives that uh, the conditions on the ship were uh very dismal uh, and uh, that they have limited access to food and bathrooms Ooh. That's disgusting. It is disgusting. That is disgusting. Oh, really? Honest to God, what the well, what the hell was that? Yeah, really? Yeah. Oh, excuse me, but the the ship is like, what is this Titanic? The only thing I, <laughs> like, the only I, thing I want to know about a, on a cruise is when's the midnight buffet? Oh, no, yeah. Midnight buffet, yes. But what? I'm surprised they didn't get on their whatever those lifeboats and just like go go get off the yeah, ship. Yeah, but how many lifeboats are there for a boat? That's a good question. You know, I mean, the Titanic had enough boats for all the passengers, and half of them still managed to die. (laughs) (laughs) According to the movie. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, poor Leonardo died, so I mean, I don't know. So sad. (laughs) So So sad. 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 Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh, Leonardo. Whatever happened to him, anyways? He died and went to heaven. <laughs> <laughs> he went. I don't know what happened to him. Uh, did, is, isn't he in another movie? Is he? Hmm. Yeah, he did some like weird something recently? sci-fi type movie. Oh. Like recently, though? Uh, a couple years so. ago, I mean. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, J. Edgar. He did the J. Edgar movie. Oh. 
Didn't see he that. Did he played Congressman J. Edgar or CIA agent, whatever it was. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, was, you know what? Here, here's an interesting story. Though. This one goes out to uh, actually a friend of mine who's listening. He does Comcast Sports here in Tampa. And uh, so, I'm kidding, sports here. Yeah, he's uh, he's Drew Filios. Yeah, Drew's a good guy. He's always calling in on the show. Oh, Remember? by the way, that Leonardo movie was Inception. Oh, <laughs> you did you did Wait, you just look it up? I'm like, like, I'm like, go we, from J. Edgar sorry. to Inception. What the? I, I just really, got the text that told me somebody God. just one of my friends just answered the <laughs> answered it for me. One of the texts just answered it, so I'm like, okay. Wow. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Jeez, uh, see, people are listening. Oh they're just afraid to call it. I know. People call <laughs> I know. in. I just to... call. Come on. No, Somebody just, uh, call in. A Somebody, lot of people please. are listening tonight, by the way. Um, <clears throat> so listen to this. Uh, Comcast's $16.7 billion deal to buy the remaining half of NBC Universal ahead of schedule uh, represents a, a resounding vote of confidence in the future of television. Hmm. George, <laughs> you want to comment on that? <laughs> well, it's like, well, they've already bought NBC to begin with from GE, so they're just, I think they're just trying to get the other half of it from GE. Yes. I mean, yeah, NBC I hasn't really done anything since what? Uh... Friends went off the air. And not, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yes, when did Friends go off the air? I forgot. I don't know. Never really that, watched the I show. I think it was like Friends? I watch Friends. I mean, I'm not you know that shallow. Uh, uh, we have we do have a caller. <laughs> oh uh, yes. uh, let's go to a caller. Caller, you're on the air, round two. Hello. <laughs> what the hell is up, round two? What's up? <laughs> Who is this? This is Mikey Rocks. Mikey. Okay, Mikey. Well, uh, where are you calling from tonight? Mikey Rocks is calling from Clearwater, Florida. He's tuning in. And he loves your fucking show. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Mikey. Uh, you want to ask uh, Amy the first time we're uh, here on the show? I mean, everybody else Anything? wants to ask her questions. So might as well. Yeah. I'm a first time caller. First time caller. Woo! Thank you. All right. Woo! From a first time caller Woo-hoo! to a first time radio host. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> on the round two. Anyway. <laughs> All right. Let's hear it. Hey, Amy. Yes. <laughs> oh. It's Valentine's Day tomorrow. You sound so familiar, this guy. Well, it's Valentine's Day tomorrow, okay? Yes, it is. <laughs> so, I want to know, for all the viewers out there, you got a Valentine? I don't. Can you believe that? But why? I don't and, know. And she's hot. I don't know. You are hot. It's sad. Fellas, why y'all could ask her to be the Valentine? <laughs> oh, we have a Valentine's Day. you an hour now? ago? Wow. Woo! Do I have a date? you have a date? Do I have a date? Woo. Oh, you. come on, dude. Don't tell me you backed oh, out now. You. Yeah. You, me and you, we can go out. We can be Valentine's. Really? Where, where, first of all, where are you going to take mm. me? Well, first off, I'm going to take you on a, a $20 max date to Gyro's. $20 max date? Because, <laughs> you know, they had the 10 wings and fries. So I can just get a 10 wings and fries. You have five. I have five. And we split half of the fries. I don't like wings, though. Oh, well, baby, they got burgers, they got wraps, calamari, you know, that finer shit. They have calamari? What's the name of this restaurant? Yeah, really. Gyro's. Oh, Gyros. oh, I'm sorry. It's called Salem's. Gyro's is just a ghetto <laughs> serve. <laughs> oh can, uh, you know what? We have another call, yeah, apparently, or we call, did. So. <laughs> did um, Whoever that was, call again. I, hey, look, all right. We have to Let's watch chat again, that, man. Right? This is Mikey Rocks. One time from Clearwater. Peace. Mikey Rocks. See ya. Mikey Rocks. And he rocks. I yeah. think. Rocks. <laughs> oh, what was that? I mean, you, you, Rocks like the cheap Salem? date. Oh, man. Really? Come on, like, dude. Really? Wings? Eight, okay, the, the, the number, by the way, is area code 813-639-8255 if you want to call in. That 224 uh, num- number could call back. Yeah, we had a 224 number there. I think it was a, what's 224, Chicago? Northwest Illinois. Oh, wow. They're listening, listening, listening to us all over the place. Wow. That's pretty cool. Uh, all right. Uh, once again, 813-639-TALK, 813-639-8255. Let's carry on to some good stuff. Are we carrying on? Yeah, anyone carry else on. want to ask uh, Amy out on a date? No. Yeah, does anyone? Don't take me to Wings, please. Salem's. No, Salem, have don't. you ever been there before? That's no, like a... I, I have not. All right, don't worry, baby. I got you a place to go. All right, good. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to give the clues out. Okay, uh, I don't know if anyone watched last night. 
Um, let's talk about this because it's a big issue in the news right now. Uh, gun control. Oh, yeah. It's huge in the news right now. And uh, I'll tell you, uh, President Obama a- actually spoke about gun control for the first time in Congress last night on, on the on the State of the Union uh, address. Did anyone watch that here? Or, like, I watched a little bit one? towards the end of ah, it. Wasn't that like the best? I mean, speech-wise, and I, I, I emphasize on speech, speech-wise, it was one of the best yeah, speeches. Yeah, I could say. I mean, I, I, whether I really you like do. him or not, whether you like Obama or not, speech, yeah. and he he can deliver a message to the, to he the did. for the most part. And, and I think he did. I mean, I'm a Republican. I'm going to be honest with that, you know, but and, and I did not vote for Obama, but the last night uh, he spoke very well. Yeah, he did. Uh, Very especially well. at the end. Now, what he spoke about uh, was uh, Hydea Pendleton. She was killed uh, by Chicago gang members. And those two that were... A week after she was at the president's inauguration. That's right, George. You got it. And, and she performed something. Uh, she performed there? Yeah, she performed with a marching band in yeah. school or something like that. And then a week later, she goes back to Chicago, where you think it's safe. Yeah. And a mile away from his house... President Obama's house. He uh, in the park there in well, Hyde Park. Yeah, he lives in. He's from Hyde Park. Hyde Park, Chicago, exactly, not Florida. Yeah, Hyde Park, Chicago. Hyde Park, Chicago. Not, exactly, not Hyde Park, Florida. Hyde Park, it's Chicago. Not exactly is not exactly one of the safest neighborhoods no. in the city. Hyde Park, Tampa is more like Lincoln Park for our Chicago listeners, but Hyde Park. Uh, yeah, it's where you know University of Chicago and everything like that. But it's uh, around it. It's not exactly the safest. Yeah, neighborhood. it's uh, it's the south side of yeah. Chicago, and it's not the greatest area. Have you ever been? To Chicago? Yeah. No. Oh. Never. We have to get you there. It is a lot of fun. You're now. supposed to take me. Uh, yeah, you're supposed to go. <laughs> right. we'll, we'll, we'll work on that. Let's make a trip. <laughs> Let's make a trip. <laughs> um, uh, but uh, the the basically the girl got killed. Uh, yeah, shot she was in the just back th- by by two gang members like who the- are now, by the way, under arrest and uh, uh, now uh, not not even on bond. Yeah, I believe. Well. So they, so it's they did one of the few them. issues that we're going to have to uh, do. Yeah. And uh, what, what do you think about gun control right now? I mean, do you think it's going to pass? It's going to be hard. I mean, it's it's a very, very big subject, and it's hard to pass anything that's considering it's an amendment. Right. You know, but I think people tend to forget, like, when the amendments were written the, back in 1776, it was to prevent, you know, to, to defend yourself from... The English and that were the British that were invaded and everything like that, but um, I don't think when they wrote it they would imagine that people can be able to own a right uh, uh, what do you call it assault rifles, grenade launchers, rocket launchers and stuff like that. Right. I mean, you know, for someone to own that needs a machine gun to just you know kill that shoots uh, thirty rounds in a split second. I mean, now that's just crazy. You don't need any of that. No, you know, I understand you want to defend yourself, but dude, I mean, you're not going to war here. <laughs> All, right, All right, we, we have, have a call. call. Uh, uh, let's let's go to our caller. Uh, <laughs> caller, go ahead. Hi, you're on New York. Hey, how you guys doing? Good. How are you? Hi, Paul. I'm not bad. Hey, uh, first time caller. How you guys hey. doing? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, quick uh, comment on the gun control here. I just yeah, want to make a comment coming from Chicago. I uh, I feel that uh, gun control in general as a law is not really working out too well. I think Chicago is a great example of that because next to District of Columbia, we have the toughest gun laws in the country. Do we really? And yeah. we have the highest murder rate in the country. Really? So I don't know. Do you have the, what, uh, you have the statistics I'll go on ahead that? And, go ahead. Sorry. Have, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. You have the statistics on that? We don't have that in front of us. I don't. I don't have them in front of me, but it's a pretty talked about subject. Whether I'm at the office or if I'm listening to the radio here, um, granted there are two sides of every argument, and you're going to hear right. the pros and cons from both of them. But hmm. that's just something I want to throw out there, something for you guys to chew on and uh, think about. I don't know if you guys hear the same stuff we do. You know, coming from different areas. Yeah, you know, we, we do. And I mean, we, yeah, we hear it more on a, on a national level, not much as on a local level. <laughs> Depends, like, how local you, if you we look into it. But it is true, though. We The Chicago does have 
they have like one of the strictest gun laws and yet it has the highest crime rates that's crazy when you look at like states like texas that you can you can carry a shotgun in your car and you don't hear too many murders in texas like you do in like you hear in Chicago all the time. I mean, granted, you don't see the Chicago. Chi- Chicago, if if uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe Chicago have the most highest uh, gun. Yeah, they had uh, the strictest gun laws, and yet yeah. people are still getting strictest killed. Gun laws and the most murders. Most I murders. I think the thing you. is in Texas, of gu- people with guns are afraid last, to uh, last people year. are afraid to commit crimes in Texas because yeah. everyone's packed. I mean, you'll think twice if you're gonna <laughs> you want to rob a bank or something. Yeah. <laughs> so. I'll uh, I'll let you guys go. Thanks for right, your thanks, time. Callers. Thank you very much. We appreciate that. All right. And if you if you have you know, you'd like to call in, give us a call eight one three six three nine eight two five five. Sorry, we had another caller, but our engineer apparently left the studio. And eight one three. No, I know. Man. We love you, Scott. <laughs> we know that. I know. I know. <laughs> Scott's our engineer. He's one of the best when he's in the room. <laughs> uh, I'm so so. <laughs> we love you, man. We love you. All right, eight one three six three nine eight two five five. If you want to get in on this, um, is, if we have, can get that caller back uh, again, I, I think that was a seven seven three number. We're not really supposed to say that. <laughs> that doesn't well, matter. Just yeah, we don't want yeah. to. We don't want to <laughs> so get that like, person in trouble. You, you, you don't want to be scared to call. Yeah. You know, there's another something uh, we could something really quick about local. Yeah, go ahead. They have some. I guess in Pasco County, and they must have something with like the sheriff is having trouble with people buying and selling pills and stuff. Really? Really? What but, kind of pills? Right, who knows? I mean, XT, whatever. It's like, <laughs> still, like, like, do people still do ecstasy? Apparently, they do still they? do. I, that was some 90 thing. Was it 90s or 2000s? 90. Nine, late 90s. Mm. You're right, 99, 2000. Yeah. That yeah, are, they're yeah, probably more like the synthetics yeah. and stuff like it's that. Like that. It's like that XL nightclub that was closed yeah. in Chicago. You remember XL? Yeah. Do you remember XL? The old Mercedes, yes, oh, I remember. Geez. You know, that club... There was a big story behind that. <laughs> yeah, and no, Chuck, well, we Chuck could talk Gowdy. that amongst ourselves, you know. <laughs> Chuck Gowdy did that. Yeah. That belonged to Chuck Gowdy at ABC7. But, you know, so. eh, nobody knows who Chuck Gowdy is, though. Yeah, Come on. <laughs> in Chicago they do. Yeah. <laughs> do they ever? <laughs> but then again, you know, it's like, you know, anything like goes on with pills and stuff, it's like sometimes it seems like uh, nothing new. Yeah. I mean, what is there to do in Pasco County anyways? Nothing. I know. It's boring. <laughs> well, you know, I'm sure it's not. Don't get me wrong. I'm not there all the time. But, I mean, I'm sure if you're there, you, I'm sure there's something to find, you our, know. Our fine police officers of the Tampa Bay Police office, Police, right? <laughs> right. Mm-hmm. You know, I guess maybe it's Oxy and Roxy's and all that Oxy stuff. They're not as corrupted as... Woo-hoo. Tampa Bay Police are not as corrupted here as they are in Chicago, though, are they? Well, no, but you never know, man. Yeah, well... <laughs> You have a little comment about that. You can call in 813-639-8255. Uh, anyway, uh, listen to this story. Ooh. Horse meat. You've heard this? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> exactly. Well, first there was uh, pink slime, Ugh, then disgusting. horse meat uh, most recently, and uh, then the recent uh, re- revelations that uh, such products have reached dinner tables, including horse meat falsely labeled as beef in Europe, Ugh. now uh, have uh, cast unappetizing light on the global food industry. Ugh. Oh, we have a call. Go ahead. Uh, let's. Let's. Uh, hello, caller. Hi. Were you? Were you guys supposed to call me? <laughs> I don't know. No, you're supposed to call us. <laughs> Oh. oh, hi! My name is my 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 name is Bill. First time caller. Hello, Hello, Bill. Hello, Bill. How you doing? All right. How are you yeah. doing? Well, I, I got I got a question for you guys. Uh, about this gun uh, gun uh, laws and everything. Back to the gun control. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that's a way of the government trying to control the people. To be honest with you, I mean, I'm not a fan of, uh, you know people walk around the streets with guns but you know what if it comes to a time and moment where uh you know a civil war breaks out what do you you know and the government turns on you i think it's just another play for the government to control the people i mean am i making any sense to you yeah, guys here or what perfect no, you sense, are. Though. Yeah. i mean there's gun control i mean taking guns away from us but it just seems like sometimes people are getting carried away 
I think, with these guns. You know, Columbine, uh, Columbine. Wow, that's a, you know, V Tech, yeah, Northern yeah. Illinois University. Everyone, movie yeah, theaters. Man. I mean, it's just you uh, can't even go to a movie nowadays. I know, but I mean, it's like yeah, sometimes you, it, you could think it's like I think it's sometimes the government could be like behind it, but that's you know, this is my opinion. You know, I don't want the feds coming after me now. <laughs> I just think if you're gonna get a gun, you're gonna get a gun, yeah. like whether it's against I got a good idea. Okay. Uh, Sell the guns at a the decent price, but each bullet should be a thousand dollars. Yes, that's a, that's a good way of solution, man. You'll think twice about shooting. That's true. Yeah, that's right. Well, th- th- thanks a lot for answering that. You guys got a nice show. It was my first time. No, uh, thank you, man. Oh, by the way, go thanks, Republicans. Bill. Go Republicans. Go Republicans. <laughs> yes. <laughs> thanks, man. I, I, I thanks a lot, guys. One. Thank you. All right, thanks. And uh, Louis and uh, Nick's phone's going off. Yeah, crazy. my phone's going off here. Uh, yeah, thanks, Jeremy. <laughs> it's a friend, friend of mine. Anyway, um, so back to the horse meat. Back to the well, <laughs> yeah, horse meat. That's horse nothing meat, new. That's Come horrible. on, man. But that's not what, what, horse meat's nothing that? new, you know, man. George, it, you know, get us into this. <laughs> well, I mean, come on. They used to have. Then they say back in the day, like, oh, was it checkers? Used to have like. Rats in their meat Ew. and McDonald's what is the horse the meat. What is the McRib? The exactly? McRib is probably it's it's just disgusting. Just... Everything at McDonald's is garbage. Mm-hmm. You know, I mean, it, it looks nice from the outside now, but it's still on the inside, still garbage. Yeah, I mean, there's there's a, there's a true fact: best, <laughs> best food does kill. Other than the salad, right now, <laughs> <laughs> really. <laughs> Honest to God, no offense, McDonald's. So you've had a McRib and we'll never, before. Uh, ugh. Have disgusting. you? It, You've had it. Yeah, and it's like it was mm. bone. I know. I don't get why it has I, to look like it has to have a bone in it, though. I, why would you want to eat that? I don't know why anyone want to eat it. <laughs> or, uh, I won't even want to. I, um, there's probably even kangaroo in there. Mm. Ew, mm. Disgusting. Yeah. Bouncy I mean, bones. I, I ate it because it was good a long time ago when it was real ribs, but now it's like. Ugh. I think it was real rib. A long time ago when it what? first came out. I don't right? think so. No? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who knows, man? It's yeah. it's like know. chicken McNuggets. It's like, t- <laughs> it's like the cigarette <laughs> company telling us that cigarettes aren't addictive. Come Where's on. the Surgeon General when you need her? Yeah, right? <laughs> She's probably getting some Oxy pills in, uh, in uh, Pasco County. So yep. Exactly. <laughs> All right. Here's a story now. Uh, an avid gambler finds an unlikely kidney donor at a casino. Uh, Tim Brennan. Has That's a good been, place to find him. Yeah, right. Tim Brennan has been a regular at the casino uh, in Des Plaines, Illinois, uh, since it opened. The 64-year-old man uh, is retired firefighter. Uh, he had his dreams, of course, winning big, but he never thought he would find a kidney donor there. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, apparently the uh, the doorman that he or the the car. What is it called? The valet. Thank you. The, the valet. valet guy knows him, and uh, the valet guy uh, apparently uh, uh, knew who he was. He didn't see him there for a while. He knew he was ill because he all, uh, looked ill. That's what he said. And uh, and then he said, well, what's wrong? And uh, the gentleman said, well, he told him his problem, and uh, he gave him his kidney, a kidney of his. Wow. There you go. Oh, that's a good story. Who are you texting over there? <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> you don't know who you're texting. Everyone, oh, everyone's, everyone's, awesome. everyone's texting. Everyone's texting. Eight one three. Well, tell them us. to call in. Yes, eight one three six three nine talk. Eight one three six three nine. All my text messages. Call in. Call in. Exactly. I see some of those. I see these texts. Here's. We're almost done with this because then we're going to get on to Super St. Valentine's Good, Day special. Thank you. Which you have been waiting yes, for. Yes, this is my favorite part. <laughs> we're almost done here. we got to get through the news stories, though, because it's part of the show. And yeah, we have right. a call. We have a call. Woo-hoo. Let's uh, Let's rock and roll. Uh, let's go to our caller. Caller, caller, hello. Hello? You're on the air with round two. Hey, how's it, go- how's it going, guys? Hey, how's it going? Hey, what are you up to? Hey, um, What's your second name? time caller. I second called in uh, my first time last week. Oh, I, oh, I think say, it was the guy uh, hello up to on. everyone. Papa George, how you doing? What's up? Oh, What's Papa George. On? Papa he remembers George. You. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> so I wanted to uh, I wanted to comment on the last two callers uh, about their uh, about their time on gun control. Um, I just want to say that they don't know what they're talking about, <laughs> and I completely agree with uh, what Obama says about gun control. And wait, wait, wait you're, you're calling from where? Chicago? Yeah, I'm, I'm calling Call from, from Chicago. Yeah. Oh wow, <laughs> calling from Chicago, Chi Town. 
So, um, yeah, I know you guys are tired of talking about the uh, gun control thing, but I, I caught the tail end of the horse meat thing. What's that all about? There's horse meat uh, in, down in Florida in your restaurants? What's going on? Uh, Nick? Yeah. I mean, you're, you're, Hello? You with your phone over here. No, I'm sorry. So my phone is going off. What was your question again, George? I apologize. George? Go ahead. I didn't, what was your question no, I, again? I, I caught the tail end about the horse meat. What's going on with the horse meat? Well, they were saying something that in the, the U.K. have been finding traces of horse meat in the burgers at Burger King, by the way. <laughs> so, oh, wow. But, you know, but never know. So, uh, I mean, horse meat, I think I hear Italians like that stuff, too, though. Italians oh. like horse meat? I don't what? know. It must be a delicacy. When? I don't like horse meat. She's Italian. She, does, yeah. she hates horse meat. She's Sicilian, so she doesn't count. Oh, wait, what? Sicilian? Why? Why is that? Why do people say that? Wait, are you I don't Sicilian? know. You guys... I am. I just told you that. You... Oh. Uh, I think I got cut up. Oh. Yeah. So, but uh, as with the horse meat, you know, it's it's probably nothing new. You never know. I mean, you gotta subsidize. You gotta use something to make some money. You know, cut some costs <laughs> and stuff like that. Yeah. You know, maybe so, they're trying to make all those race horses or something. You know, yeah. Kentucky Derby uh, winners. It's funny. <laughs> all right. Well, uh, thanks for taking my call, guys. I Thank appreciate you. it. Thank you. Call uh, go, Bears. Go, go Bears. Go Bears. I guess yes. Go New York Giants. Okay. Anyway. Love you, <laughs> oh, you we're know. still on the air? <laughs> yeah, oh apparently Sorry. we still are. Oh, my God. Okay, guys. We're almost done with this, but uh, listen to this. For those of you who are like, you know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to switch the story because uh, we're going to save that for last because we're going to, that'll lead into our uh, wonderful. Thank you. Uh, yeah, finally. Yeah, I know. Um, okay. Here's a story out of Chicago real quick. This is really good. I mean, this is really funny, actually. Authorities in Chicago say a 73-year-old ex-convict told investigators that uh, he became accustomed to his lifestyle prison and wanted to get caught when he robbed another bank so he could live his final years behind bars. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Yes. It doesn't uh, matter how old you are, you're still going to go out stealing. That's right. Uh, he wore no disguise during Saturday's heist. <laughs> Uh, that he uh, netted him. I actually, he got the money. $4,178. Did he use a gun or did he use his cane? He used his cane. <laughs> so, he, <laughs> so he wanted to go back to jail. Yeah. Apparently. He wants to finish well, off what he started. Because well, he's like, I don't want to, I don't want to, uh, you know what? Haven't you ever seen Shawshank? No. You've never seen Shawshank oh, Redemption. Shawshank Redemption. Come on. I, I think I fell asleep through it. What? Oh, sorry. That's like one of the best movies ever. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I know. You've seen that movie, right? Yeah. What movie? Shawshank, Shawshank Redemption. Oh, yeah, what are you doing over seen. there? What are you? Are you playing with yourself? <laughs> That's what no, it kind of no, looks like. Person. To be honest, yeah. I think I'm getting, I'm getting some flirts hmm. and stuff like that. You're getting some flirts. Yeah. Ooh, anyway, yeah, listen. Uh, when authorities. Uh, Tracked him to a uh, motel. Don't leave on me alone. <laughs> when authorities did track him to a hotel on uh, uh, Sunday, uh, he immediately threw down his cane and was <laughs> surrounded, saying he knew that, that well why why they were there, and he went uh, very quietly. And good for him. Yeah. Seventy. Wow. Yes. Congratulations! You get the guy in jail. Seventy-three years old, and awesome. all he wants to do is go back to jail. <laughs> Just, hmm. Really. <laughs> and are, are the engineers like, oh my god, <laughs> like <laughs> weird stories coming out of Chi Town? <laughs> okay, uh, do you guys do you guys like liquor? Obviously, hello. Oh, yeah. Who doesn't? Liquor. Listen to this. Oh yeah. Marker, oh, yeah. This pisses me yeah, off. Right Maker's here, Mark, the famous uh, liqueur. I love Maker's Mark. Yeah, well, you're not gonna love it after this story. Uh, Maker's okay. Mark has responded after angry customers took to Twitter. Uh, to complain about the company lowering alcohol content in its whiskey, which I uh, believe it is. Uh, how horrible is that? Uh, due to unforeseen demand, Marker's Mark, Maker's Mark, sorry, Marker's, <laughs> Marker's Mark, Mark. I, I can't see this, <laughs> announced that it would uh, be de decre decreasing the proof of its whiskey by 3% from uh, go, from nine, I'm sorry, 90 proof. Why does that, uh, is that a typo? Right I can't. I can't What's even see what's in you? front of me. 90 proof to 84 proof. Go proof. <laughs> yeah, 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 we need a go proof right now. I need some go. liquor in me. Oh, my God. <laughs> Blue martini. 
can we just go there now? Yeah. Can we? <laughs> like, uh, the brand still wanted to keep the prices competitive without rise, uh, raising them uh, out of reach. Hmm. Yeah. All right. Yeah. It's not uh, them. It's the how do you water text. down alcohol? I'm so upset about that. Yeah. Is, I are, are they going to keep continuing it? Uh, sure. What? Uh, that's so stupid. If you have a comment about that, you better call in. 813-639-TALK. 813-639-8255. Okay, that wraps up the news. Well, that's good news because guess what? Uh, are we are we going to a commercial break? Can, can we go to like a two-minute commercial break? Uh, we have engineer. no engineer. We have, we He's have not no engineer. Scott, uh, hello, back uh, there. Because <laughs> when we come back, we are re- ready to roll for our... Uh, we are really ready to roll. Time for to our, let uh, the good times exactly. roll. Exactly, we're gonna do our get into our Super Saint Valentine's Day special. But uh, let's go to a like a minute or two minute commercial break. Can we do that? Uh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. We got the thumbs up. We, we got, got the thumbs, thumbs up. up. All right, we'll be right back and uh, please call in eight one three six three nine talk. We're gonna be when we come back. We are gonna talk about your sex. Valentine's <laughs> and sex and all that good stuff. And how all right. I, and how I water down my vodka. And how you water uh... down. Now, as we do that, we'll go to a break. <laughs> Stay with us. The West Central Coast of Florida has an amazing music scene, festivals, clubs, special performances, and there's always a lot of live music. The problem has always been getting the word out about events. Then GoTonight.com emerged on the scene. The brainstorm creation of founder Don McKeon, a Sarasota entrepreneur. We caught up with Don and his inspirational friend, Frank Papa, at the Flying Dog Cafe. This is Frank. I'm Don. Frank is the reason that there is a GoTonight.com. He would call me, he would call me repeatedly. Where are we going? Where do you want to go? Where are we going tonight? The website has been a boon to many small clubs. So next time you find yourself asking, where will we go tonight? You've got the answer. The West Central Coast of Florida has an- My name is Barack Obama. Given extraordinarily difficult circumstances in Afghanistan from the last few weeks, what makes you confident that two years from now when the last troops leave, it will be better than it is today? Look, uh, what, what I can walk by. Girls be looking like that. You fly. I pick to the bee, walking down the street in my new freak. This is how I roll. Animal print. That's out of control. It's red fool with the big F roll. And like Bruce Lee, I got the glow. Look at that body. Look at that body. Look at that body. I work out. Look at that body. Look at that body. Look at that body. I work out. When I walk in the spot, this is what I see. Everybody stops and very at me. I've got the patch in my hands. And I'm afraid to show it. Show it. Show it. Show it. I'm sexy. Okay, we are. We are. Are we back? We're back. Yes, we are back. Sorry Tag about that, guys. Back Take again. a little commercial Let break. Gold. Let us begin. All <laughs> right. This is the part where everybody's been waiting for, I'm sure. As we promised, the Super St. Valentine's Day special is on right now. And we've got... Oh, okay, goody, goody. We have Amy and Amy and Georgia. We're going to be talking about a lot about sex, obviously. Yes. Yes. Everybody Let's talk about sex, talk- baby. Yes. Let's talk about you and me. <laughs> Everybody talk about sex. <laughs> All right. Uh, wow. Let's talk about relationships. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Don't know anything about mm-hmm. that. Uh, oh, please. You've never had a relationship? Uh, really? Oh, I've had a few, but, you know. This is the fun part of the show, guys. But <laughs> you never know. You never know. Yes. <laughs> There's some you just don't want to admit to. Oh, shit. And because it is Valentine's Day... Uh, tomorrow, first of all, happy Valentine's Day to Amy. Happy Valentine's Thank Day. Because we all love her. Oh, and Thank she's you. so we kind. Love you Amy, too. we love she was, you. She was so kind to fill in tonight. Yes. And of course, she, she's so kind to say, yes, she will fill in for the next couple of times. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay. All right. All right. Are you and, buying me uh, drinks? After? Yes. Yes. Sweet. Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, yeah. Okay. Anybody watch we... that movie, Ted? Yes. Oh, I love that. You know the beginning. That was hilarious. Was like, oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yes. uh, that that was just like the best. I, I that was the best movie of the year, I think, back then. That was, that was a good movie. Well, <laughs> the first time I saw it, I thought it was hilarious, and the second time I was like, mm. 
Really? Mm. It was a bear, talking bear. <laughs> I mean, and what do you want? What do you want from the talking bear? I don't know. I, don't <laughs> know. Like, I love you. Stick the finger <laughs> in the loop of my dick. Oh, Stick the funny. finger up my dick. <laughs> <laughs> What did you just say? No, no, I said stick your finger to the loop of my tag. Oh, I thought... Oh, my God. What are you what talking about, man? And it has begun. And we know what's on your mind. If yes, you've seen the exactly. movie, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. So, uh, relationships. You, you've had a few. A few. A few. Just a few. <laughs> so, this is your segment. You what's get to talk about your relationships and uh, what they were like. Oh gosh! Please. <laughs> Ooh la la! Oh, please ask me a question. I'm going to in a minute. In a um, minute. Uh, why are they so hard for you? <laughs> oh, <shit>. I don't know. <laughs> Too tough. Because Too guys tough. are juicy, crazy. Juicy. That's why guys are freaking crazy. Because women I mean, are more sane. <laughs> why are guys crazy? All right. I don't admit that girls are just crazy. I mean, mm. you know, girls are crazy, but guys make us that way. Uh... You guys do. Uh-oh, you guys, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, guys. Oh, maybe, God. maybe. Depends what mm. what douchebags you're rolling with. Maybe, but you know. <laughs> what douchebags? <laughs> I have. I'm yeah, a nice a guy. <laughs> yeah, you're a nice guy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. I, I, you guys gonna? I, you know what? Maybe should I switch seats? Why? No, you might okay. need to. You we might... like we like you in the middle. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm in the middle. Okay. Yeah. Oh, just want to make sure. Yeah. There's like something going on with you too. What? <laughs> va, 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 boom, you know? Oh my lord! Uh, uh. But relationships are hard. I mean, I, I, they everyone's are. been in one. And... They're very complicated. Yeah. Wh- why though? I mean, what do guys do to you <laughs> that makes makes it so hard? What? What? I mean, wh- what is that? I don't know. And what the hell are you doing over here? I know. <laughs> I, he's like distra- I have ADD. Hello, and he's like so air. distracting me. You know we're doing a show. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> like, are we? Okay. I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> I, uh, I just okay. hear ding ding. ding. So, I, we want to hear from you out there. Yes. Now. Callers, yeah, okay. call in now, about now listen, your relationships. If you are in a relationship, if you are, if you've had one, if you, if you are. If you are in a difficult one, if you're in a, if you're straight, bi, gay, it doesn't matter who you are, call in because we want to hear from you. We want to hear your stories. Give us a call, 813-639-8255. Let's do this. Okay. All right. Why do you think guys cheat? Ah, uh, guys cheat because... Women nag. <laughs> we nag. Women nag. <laughs> what do we nag about? Wow. I've heard this a lot from different guys. It, so now, so. it comes from George here. I George, just want to hear you. are the expert. Let's go. They, they nag a lot about a lot of things, about man. About what? Like how they don't make enough money, <laughs> how they don't drive a nice car, oh, how the ring man. is not big enough. Yeah. Yikes. <laughs> <laughs> how the what's not big enough? Oh. The ring. The ring. I don't know. Something. Put a ring on. <laughs> nah, but you, you know what? I'm just kidding. No, I think women, Women. I mean, I, I know men that nag, too. Have you been married? So. No. No? No, thank Have God. Have you been engaged? No. Wow. No. Close. 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 Oh, really? Yes. Well, women, I mean, they... Was that the... Huh? Yeah, huh? Uh, oh, <laughs> the one I know, right? Mm, yeah. Mm. Interesting person. Eight one three six three nine eight two five five. Give us a call. Oh, uh, please do <laughs> before somebody I get killed in this studio. <laughs> <laughs> I think Amy's gonna hate me afterwards. All right, <laughs> oh, all right. What, have you ever cheated? Mm. No. Don't lie. Never? <laughs> no. Don't lie. Oh, come on. No, I haven't. All right. How many serious relationships have you been in? Ah, uh, here we go. And it begins. Mm-hmm. <laughs> to be honest, none. You've <clears throat> never been in a serious Not relationship? Not a re- serious one. Just like a, like uh, you want to call it like puppy. Like a hookup? A hookup or something. Yeah, but serious? None, really. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I'm, a little, I'm a little behind on this subject. Wow. Okay, who's your Holy perfect girl? goodness. Who's your like... Yeah, like celebrity, like give us a crush. celebrity crush. Celebrity crush. We know who Amy's is. Yes. Oh man. I can't. I can't even think right now. Do you like? I'm trying to brunettes, think. Brunettes, blondes, redheads. I like them all. I mean, I'm not <laughs> gonna like say. <laughs> of course you, you do. You gotta pick one. You know. Nah. Well, I just it's usually just whatever whichever one you can get along with. I mean, <laughs> I mean, not necessarily just get along with. I mean, it's just like when it happens, it happens. <laughs> you know, everybody has a type, though. I think we we, we do I, have a sometimes. Type. You know, has a type. Uh, what's your type? I like dark hair. Oh, dark hair. Tan, Tan, green eyes, green eyes, 
spiky brown hair. <laughs> spiky brown hair. I have like wow. down to what, I got everything but the green hey, eyes. Are we? Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> like, it has to it can't just be hair. It has to be I mean, spiky. So, a few tattoos, wow. maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Sometimes I like the, the, the nerdy plain Janes, though, too. Yeah. A lot of guys <laughs> like the plain Janes, I think. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. I think. Do they? Yeah. Mm-hmm. What do you like, Nick? Uh, <laughs> I I don't talk about my personal life on the air. But, what? Uh, Why not? Because it's, it's, it's not right on the air. But, I mean, I was married once to a woman. Mm, and, that's uh, right. You yeah. told me that. And, well, yeah, uh, you were. Yeah. And uh, she was crazy. blonde, hair, blue eyes. She yeah. was gorgeous. Mm. Yeah. I mean, I, I just, I, she was, she was hot. Yeah. Just, uh, she turned just... out to be a lesbian. I mean, that was... So she was a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. We got a caller. Uh, uh, let's go to our call. Um, caller. Hello. How are you? You're on yes, here, round two. You? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi. 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 How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Who, uh, who is this? They call me Vincent. Vincent. Okay. <laughs> okay. Go ahead, Vincent. You're on the air. <laughs> oh, am I? Yeah. Well, all I'm going to say is the reason why guys like playing James is because it's safe. They know what to expect and it's boring to them. So they know what to expect from them, and it's a higher chance for them to not cheat. Mm, that's a good way to put it. Uh, thoughts, Amy? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so they like plain Janes because why now? Because they know exactly what to expect from them, and chances are they're not going to go out and cheat. Ah. Oh. That's a good point, but, mm. I mean, it's they're not, they also, I mean, they're just, depends what they like. I mean, they're not, like, High, not necessarily like saying high maintenance. Like, I mean, there's nothing wrong with maintaining yourself, but like, sometimes, like, we, like I said, with plain James, they're just, they're, they're chill, they're cool, they're, they're, they're open to anything. Like, meaning, like, hey, let's go try this. So like, okay, let's go. Or like, they're not gonna be like, no, nah, you know, oh. yeah, high maintenance. You know, true. Right. I get but you. Who doesn't want to go? Who wants to run out and go? You know what? Let's go try this. Let's go try that. Sometimes yeah. this guy wants the girl to take charge too. That's mm. true, too. Nah. Yeah. It's very true. All right. Let's thank see you. your point. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you very much for calling in. No problem. Uh-huh. Bye. That was, that was, that was uh-huh. nice. That was nice of her. She sounded nice. Yes. Didn't very she? nice. She yeah. did. Very cute, yeah. actually. Yeah. No. Really All right. We have another caller, do we? Uh-huh. Or we could call it back. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> thank you. Uh, well, we wait for that. Uh, yeah, if you have any questions and comments on this Valentine's Day special, and tell us about your sex life or whatever, 813-639-TALK. That's 813-639-8255. Give us a call, and uh, we will uh, hopefully hear from you and your stories because we love to hear your stories. Um, you know, this town is so weird. Tamp- Let, South let's talk Tampa, about Tampa is South Tampa. disgusting. It's not like Soho, New York, you know. <laughs> New York is different, but South Tampa, everyone thinks they're New Yorkers. They have to go out and dress pretty. and pr- They have to be, oh, I'm a pretty boy and I'm a pretty girl. Oh, blah, 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 you know. I mean, really, it's especially here. And then there, there, there are others. Now, this is interesting. Are you ready? <laughs> yep. Yes. Because Let's I go. know so many people in this town. This town is insane. Okay, the people in this town are just weird. They just... They just always are weird. I don't know if you noticed. Uh, yes. Tampa is the most, next to L.A., it has to be the most fake place on it's the very, face of this It's earth. very fake. That's why I next hate going to LA. out. Honestly. I mean, uh, oh, yes. Oh, we have a caller. Uh, oh, call him the number back. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Uh, I, I, What are we doing? I'm sorry. I, 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 can we hear that? I can. I can. Oh, okay. Caller. Hello, you're yeah. on here. Hello. Come on. What's up, yeah, man? Yeah, you're on. You're on. Oh, on good. Uh, how you guys doing today? I love the show. First Thanks. time caller. Thanks, hey, man. You who? <laughs> we got to get like a... Where, where, are you, where are you calling <laughs> from today? <laughs> yeah, we got to... I'm calling from uh, Chicago. Oh, Chicago. Another Chicagoan. Lots of Chicago. Yeah, you know, we love you guys up here. Uh-huh. <laughs> 
Hey, guys, talking about Valentine's okay. Day, right? I had a quick oh, question okay. for, I think it was Amy, right? Yes, yes, it is. Amy, it is. Yes. She's the star of the show tonight. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I, for sure. Well, next to George. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, Amy, you know, I've been going out with this girl for a little while. Mm-hmm. And, you know, I'm, uh, you know, nice dinner tomorrow, a couple of drinks. Ooh. But, you know, we really kind of want to spice it up at night. But the thing is that... Um, there's something sexually that I want to do that I know she's not going to want to. Like what? Well, you know, kind of, uh, have you ever heard of uh, Greek style? A what? Greek style? Yeah, going Greek. Going Greek. You don't walk for a week. <laughs> oh! <laughs> going Greek? Why do you, you call don't it walk that? For a week. Why Greek do you call it going stuff. Greek? <laughs> Seriously. Well, you know, it's kind of a, uh, it used to be popular back in the day amongst the Greeks. <laughs> All right, so you want her to do this. Yeah, but she's obviously going to say no, so I figured I'd give her a couple of drinks, and since it's Valentine's Day, maybe <laughs> kind of try to sneak it in there. You know, I figured I might have a little more leeway on Valentine's Day. Just buy her some diamonds. Just buy her some diamonds? Yeah. I think it's a little pricey. <laughs> you know, I don't know what she's want. You know, I don't know she's Wait, how long, <laughs> That's how, funny. how long have you been dating again? Uh, a couple months. A couple months. Mm. And you know for a fact she's going to say no. Or have you tried this before and she said no? Well, no, I haven't tried it before, but we've, you know, we've kind of joked around and we've discussed it, but she said, you know, she just shot it down right away. She said absolutely not. Yeah, she said, I've never done that. I would never do that. <laughs> Which is kind of a turn off for me because, you know, I like to explore. <laughs> I do too. Nothing wrong Nothing with, wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm trying to explain to her. You know, you don't you don't know if you don't like it unless you try it. All right. So, question to you: If she won't do this, is that like a deal breaker? Um, you know, eventually it will be, but <laughs> eventually it will be. Okay. Hey, she's gonna have to go Greek sometime. <laughs> oh wow. Yeah. So you will break up with her if she doesn't eventually do this. My like yes. <laughs> oh, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Probably. I mean, you know, um, we're not talking marriage here. It's just, you know, some Oh, it's fun. just a hookup. Yeah. Well, yeah, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's not uh, She's not really marriage material. Oh, why is that? I want to know why a guy thinks a girl is marriage material. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you want somebody a little stable, somebody... Why uh, is she not stable? You can bring home to your family. I mean, you know. My dad would appreciate her, but I don't think my mom would. <laughs> <laughs> I think dads always appreciate anything I get oh, home, to, really? you mm-hmm. know, just to get us out of the house, you know. All right, so she's hot. <laughs> yeah, she's pretty hot. Okay, why would but, your you mom know. not like her? Well, uh, she's not. Uh, how do I say? Uh, the most um, intellectually <laughs> stimulating. Oh. oh. Man. She's probably dumb as a rock. Oh, man. I'm surprised she won't. Better talking at the wall. (laughs) Better conversation. Yeah, you know, sometimes it's like pulling teeth when you talk to her. Yeah, 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 you know, she's got to be able to communicate. That's kind of what I like, too. She's got to communicate. If she can't talk, then it's like, oh, Jesus, man. So you're just banging her, then? Uh, You know, to put it politely, yes. (laughs) Oh, so yeah. it's, it's, it's oh, just yeah. a sex relationship. Oh, yeah. Jesus, guys. So it's just a sex relationship. Ay, ay, ay. Do you friends want with some? benefits, I mean, then. It's a friends with ah, benefits. Geez. We'll go with that. Why yeah. can't yeah. guys commit? But I don't really exactly. like her, so it's not really friends. It's benefits. Why can't guys commit? Really? Why can't you commit? commit, but, you know, it's got to be the girl. No. Oh. <laughs> guys can't commit. They all think alike. Have you they they ever cheated? Have you ever cheated on anyone? Oh, For me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. <laughs> no. Never? You ever been married? No. No. How old are you? I am 29. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> hmm. Mean, Never oh. cheated. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, I mean, why cheat? You know, just break up with her and That's what I one. say, but guys still cheat. Yeah, we're I mean, trying to figure out. Women. I mean, it's not just guys. It's two way street. Oh, I know. Definitely. <laughs> well, what? <laughs> <He's> <laughs> <laughs> so, you're, so you think you're a sneak attack is a bad idea? 
I don't uh, well, if she's not somebody serious, we love I would our just engineers. Go ahead she's and conscious say. enough, maybe you could sneak it in there. We love both of our engineers. I would just go they're, ahead and try they rock, it. Go by the way. Oh my god! Yeah, you I guys are fun. Right. Just give yeah, it a shot. Advice, I appreciate Get a couple oh, wow. shots of Jamesons or something. Yeah, maybe she like, might be like, okay, tequila. Tequila right will always do it. <laughs> Does anyone yeah. have no, liquor back there? No wine. Tequila. Tequila. Guys, you have liquor back there. No ice. No ice. You want, but you do want her to be conscious a little bit, you know. Just a little bit. You want to, you want yeah, to yeah, remember I mean, it. As long as she's breathing. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, because then it might be homicidal. Yeah, oh homicidal. <laughs> Nick's oh standing I, I need to stand. Because, uh, I know. Are you getting hot and bothered? Like, oh, I'm really bothered in here. Yeah. You're yeah. getting Nick <laughs> Thank hot you for your call. Thank oh you for your God. call. Thank you. Good luck. And, and Scott, Thank you. And Scott our engineer Scott is, <laughs> is like, oh, my <laughs> God. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, I, oh, I, I believe so, guys. <laughs> oh my god, you guys! Oh, that's funny. That's I so want I want some callers to call in about people that have been cheated on. Yes, if yes. you have been cheated on or or cheated or the cheat 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 yes, we got we got to make this a little bit more I, interesting I, now. Honestly, really, we want those we cheaters. I want to hear it like your worst <laughs> stories, like. Just, yeah, eight one three six three nine eight two five five. We want the call. victims. We want to hear your stories because your stories. This is like Frasier. <laughs> yes, Frasier? we will help Good you. Show, by the way. But yes, victims and <laughs> and victims and villains. Please call. Yeah, exactly. Yes, villains are especially. <laughs> please, please, please. That's so funny. Why do they call it Greek style? I still don't know. Oh, we, we have a call. caller. We have oh, a call. here we go. Yes. Hello, caller. You're on the air. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Hey, hey what's up, bro? Uh, I'm doing great. I'm doing good. Uh, good. Uh, you know, I really like the subject that you guys are talking about because I got an opinion on things. <laughs> awesome. Tell us. Let's hear it. Please tell us. Yeah, dig all in. Right. Well, first of all, uh, I want to go back uh, to that that last caller that called. Okay. Uh, you know what? I was in the same predicament as him probably about 15 <laughs> years ago. Do I do the Greek style or I don't? <laughs> you know what? It, it worked out. Uh, yeah, we drank about a bottle of tequila. <laughs> oh wow! Tell a bottle of tequila. tequila. Wow! Damn, that's I'm going with a bottle. Huh? Well, after I got done, I threw up all over the place. <laughs> oh man, that's oh, horrible. That's not good. But you know what I want to tell that guy is: don't worry, don't even bring it up. Just go right into it, like dive right into it. You know what I mean? <laughs> She's not going to say no. It's Valentine's Day. <laughs> all right, we got it. We got it. Thank you, caller. We got ourselves another call. Okay, uh, you caller, it, you're you on the it, air. You got it. No, no. Yeah, oh, we got it. So, is there, by the way, is the engineer? Is there a way that that we can put other people on hold and like because I. Yeah, you know, because I, you know, we're losing our callers. I feel bad for that. I, <laughs> I'm sorry. So I feel calling. bad for that other caller, man. But call back, please. Eight one three six three nine. Talk. You know, we've got to w- find a way. There's got to be a way. It, I mean, in all the technology that we have in yeah. this world, there has what to be a way to put on do? calls no, are on hold. All right, we're we got to see. Here we are. Right. Here we go. Connect us in. Thank you, caller. You're on. You're on. You're on the yeah. air. Round two. Hello. How you doing? Good. Thank you. Good. Uh, your question tonight. Um, I just wanted to uh, make some comments based off of what they're currently talking about. <laughs> okay. Please do. Everyone else has. Yeah, I just, uh, just want to call and uh, talk about uh, one of the previous <laughs> one of the previous callers. Sounds like we got a kid in the background. Mm-hmm. You sure you want to ask this call? <laughs> what happened? Did we lose him? No, he's still there. Oh, he's still there? Hello? 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 Oh, we lost them. We lost them. We lost them. Yeah. Oh, well. yeah. hmm. uh, sorry, we uh, we we couldn't hear that. Uh, what happened? Did you? His wife came in. <laughs> his wife came in. <laughs> she yes, like, his Whoops. wife came in. <laughs> oh, why are you on the radio? <laughs> yeah, something. Naughty, like naughty. Not or a girlfriend, whatever. Mm, whatever. Uh, I heard the kid back. There. Yeah, definitely like heard the definitely kid. Definitely a kid. De- definitely. Uh, wow. All right, Valentine's Day, eight one three six three nine. Talk. Let's talk about it. Come on, let's hear about the cheaters out there. Yeah, yeah we come want on, to victims cheaters. and villains. Please call yeah. us. But by, by the way, as I was saying before, uh, we're waiting for calls to come in. Mm-hmm. Um, this town, 
I'm not kidding. This town of Tampa is the weirdest town because it has the weirdest people. I thought they called it people. Trampa. Trampa, exactly. Yeah. And they should be called bisexual town. Let me tell you something. <laughs> no, I'm serious. Listen to this. Are you trying uh, to tell us something? No, no. no. I, I just let, let me finish my thought. Why are you sweating? Uh, please. <laughs> He's hot I'm and not sweating. I'm not like standing. I, really. All I'm right. just teasing. Come so, on. I know. All right. So if, if I can get into this, Tampa, Florida <laughs> has mm-hmm. got to be the most bisexual. You're making me hot. I'm, I know. I'm Come on. Like... <laughs> no. Really? Hey, I, okay. maybe she goes both ways too. No, you don't know. No, no. no. But Tampa, Florida. Okay. All right, Before we got we ourselves another this. call. Ah, uh, another call. Uh, caller, you're on round two. Good evening. Hello. You. Yes. Yes. You're on the air. Go ahead. Oh, how's it going, guys? Good. Good. How, How it's going with you? Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I do have a cheating story, but first I wanted to. Uh, to make some comments about uh, why do guys cheat? I believe the female on the panel kept saying that. I forgot her name. Mm-hmm. Uh, Amy. 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 Mm-hmm. Uh, we call her Geo. Amy. Yes. Amy Geo. <laughs> Amy Geo. Okay. Yeah. So um, I, I, I do agree with that, but I, I, I think women are uh, a lot worse and a lot more uh, vindictive and manipulative when it comes to that. Um, and they can definitely drive a man crazy. But I'm not saying that guys are, are, are any better, but I just think women um, kind of take it to a different level, like it's a game or something, you know? Um, but guys are just more, um, I don't know, maybe less loyal. I, I would definitely agree with that. But, are, are you um, saying like I, men, I men are, probably just, you know, they're like, I don't know, and then the women, they just want to get even. When they get even, they get even, I think. <laughs> yeah, I think women women uh, um, uh, have um, affairs versus guys just cheat. You know what I'm saying? Like women will have like long drawn out affairs with multiple people at the same time. <laughs> have you been cheated on? Have you been cheated on? I have actually. So you caught them? Um, it was more of a. It was a friend slash associate of mine involved at the same time, and he kind of told me about it. This was uh, my uh, last uh, years of high school, beginning years of college, so I was, like, a lot younger. I really didn't care, you know, but it still kind of hurt at the same time, you know. You're always, you're always thinking you're the number one uh, guy, and then uh, that happens. It kind of hurts, you know. Then you find out you're sharing. You're like, damn it. Mm. Mm. So, but, um, you know, I'm not going to say that I was the, uh, you know, the, the greatest, I guess, boyfriend, you could say, but I'd never cheated, ever. Hmm. That's interesting. How old are you? Right now? Mm-hmm. Yes, right now. 31. <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought you meant how old I was at the time. No, 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 no. Just one. I like to know people's ages and when they that, call in. Wow. Yeah. Ne- that's yeah. great um, that you never so, cheated. You know, I, um, it's I so had, nice uh, to, you know. It, it's so nice to hear that someone has has not ever cheated on I someone. Know. Very nice. To because hear. Well, I, I, I agree. Really? I, I agree with a, a couple of callers ago. I, you know, I really don't see a point to it. You know what I'm saying? Right. Right. Just break up with them, right? Right. I don't get it either. Hmm. hmm. Well, thanks for calling. Well, thank you very much. Have a great day. You thank too. You. you too. Thanks. And right. uh, wow. I mean, so if, you know, like, well, people see there are people out there who don't cheat. Hmm. There, they really, there, there really is. You think he's lying though? He could no. be lying. Well, I mean, <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't think so. Um, you know what? I'm just, I, I mean, I admit. Have I mean, you cheated? I have in the past, which I wasn't okay. happy about. Mm-hmm. But, but I'll Why tell you what. Why did you cheat? But, but wait. The relationships I have been in. When I'm in a relationship, mm-hmm. like in one, and I know the the other person's not cheating, or is cheating, then I'll cheat. Then, but then there's a call. Oh, we have a call. <laughs> a uh, hello, you're caller. You're on the air. Round two. Yeah, who died and made you motherfuckers, Doctor Ruth? <laughs> <laughs> oh man! And guess I mean, what, what the is? Fuck is going Louis. 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 What's up, Louis? Louis? I really gotta like start swearing out the door. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what's up with that guy? No wonder he wants to bang the bitch in the ass. He's like talking about you know his wife from. The valley oh, better than this one. Well, uh, you know, know, he's got to bring a little lube out of there. Yeah, he's got to, you know, <laughs> the fruit trees had the fucking cancer on them, and then 
it was kind of bitter and <laughs> God. <laughs> Well, here's that's Louis. Louis, by the way. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's All our right. guy Louis, who's okay. usually in here, and and he's on vacation right now. But he had, it was nice. Just, just, just become a homosexual and call it a day. <laughs> <laughs> or they could just bang uh, Janet Napolitano for a million dollars. Right. Yeah, and the and actually, that's uh, all right. We'll I this. wonder who uh, would bang and her, and anyways. Well, <laughs> Homeland Security. Who is? Mm. Yeah. Homeland Security chick. Okay. Yes. Yes. Thanks, George. Thanks for bringing that up. Yes. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know uh, me, man. We miss you over here, man. Uh, are you enjoying your vacation? Yeah, I, it's pretty good. I'm in my car right now. Oh. What? <laughs> He's not freezing his balls off yet. Here's a question I have for all the callers. See, now you got me talking all serious. No, seriously, do you all know who Janet Napolitano is? Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, we know who she is, man. Secretary yeah. of Homeland Security, yes. Would you bang her for a million dollars? I thought we already asked that question. <laughs> I don't know. I wasn't, Depends I wasn't how drunk I am. <laughs> <laughs> yes, would you bang and a, desperate. Uh, a member oh of Congress God. for a million dollars? <laughs> what about her and Janet Reno on a three-way for two million dollars? Oh, Now it's getting a little interesting. You want to throw in yeah, Hillary Reno, Clinton right? in on that one, dude? We'll just have it all on like gangbang with a Congress gangbang. Clinton? Mm-hmm. Okay, no, maybe I'm pushing to, a little uh, You have to look Janarino's toes. <laughs> well, why don't we just throw in, you know, <laughs> Condoleezza, Condoleezza Rice, uh, too? You know? I don't know. <laughs> Not her. Anyone but her. <laughs> After seeing all three, if I had to see all three of them in the room, then I think Monica Lewinsky is attractive. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> So I did not have sex with that woman. Of the next day, yes, <laughs> I don't know, on account of maybe it's funny. Yeah. <laughs> you know, why do women cheat? Well, because you didn't give them enough dick. What the fuck? Is, that, is that why? Is that... <laughs> Yeah, have you cheated? It is. Yeah. Because if they fucked you good, you wouldn't be running off to everybody else. It works both mm. ways. Just <laughs> Literally both ways. You got a point. Yeah. But what you do know, what do women and men want exists. out of out of life and out of out of the relationships? I think it's right? relationships are not complicated. You know what? To be honest, I think I've heard it and I've heard it before. Sex gets old, but love never does. That's so exactly. sweet. <laughs> you think oh, about it. See that? Oh, I mean, something's you know, gonna happen here. Something gonna I'm happen sure, here. Oh I think something's gonna happen. I'm sure there's people that like their. I'm sure there's women out there drink. that like their hair pulled and everything <laughs> like that. Drink. I, I By the way, if you like drink. a day with George, what's the phone number, Nico? Yeah. <laughs> it's 847. No, it's 813 oh, 639 8255. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Sorry, it's Valentine's Day. I'm trying to so throw sorry. it out there. Yeah, it's Valentine's no, I Day. Just, uh, that's my two cents. I don't know. I was just, you know, <laughs> relationships. Or else, or else it's going to be me and Amy somewhere that's People not involved $10 wings. <laughs> $10 wings. <laughs> $10 wings. What the hell? <laughs> Oh my god. Right? Thanks for uh, that other geez. caller. Jesus. Yeah, right. The oh guy god. in the beginning, the twenty dollar hot wings guy. Yeah. That guy's not joking. He does that all the, like six days a week. It works for him. There's gotta be a reason. And we know the reason. <laughs> what is that reason? Yeah, what is the reason? You have to say he knows how to beg. He probably has a gigantic penis being that he's, you know. <laughs> Do guys really think that that is the most important thing though? That's no, but it's important that. enough. It is, but if, if if your woman's well, lying to you, you know, like, gone. Gone. Yeah, your yeah, woman's lying to you, like, is it baby? Is it big enough? You're like, no. You're like, well, Being, yeah, you know, it's like I'm sure that he has the aptitude to use it correctly. Yeah, right. Now I all got right. a question. All right. It, all right, good question is um, when you guys are in a relationship, when you're in there. You know, when you're in there. When you're in there, <laughs> when, you're in there yeah. when you're in a relationship. When we're in, we're, we're there. Exactly. I'm sorry. When you exactly. are in a relationship. The land of who is, Lee, like Puff the Magic Dragon, yeah. was there. Who is, <laughs> who's the boss in the relationship? Who's, who's, uh, is it supposed to be equal? Is it, is it, or is one person have more say over the other? I don't or? think it's ever equal. Really? No. There's, there's no way. It is, never is. Otherwise, if both people were equal, they would be fighting every day. Yeah, <laughs> I think yep. so, That's but I think hours. sometimes relationship is a compromise. Well, for, for sure. I mean, you know, it definitely is. I mean, for the yeah, most Congress part, Congress isn't even a fucking compromise. <laughs> yeah, so really? I mean. <laughs> I mean, that's so, I mean, yeah, if you, I think that's what, if you look at it, because sometimes people get into marriage and they think of it as like a Congress, uh, Assembly of Congress or something, like, <laughs> it really is. It's supposed to be bad. nonpartisan no, or something, there. like, no. I got a question. <laughs> what is something that's like the biggest turnoff? Ooh, good question. 
That's different for like, everybody. I don't know. What's a deal breaker for you? Come on, Louis. No. Louis. You and Alexia. Louis, Louis. <laughs> Me, what was the biggest deal breaker? My, like, uh, like, what is something Louis, that a girl did that definitely turned you off? By the way, Louis, like, Louis, Louis has a fiance who's he's on his way to go see. No, okay. Yeah, but well, that doesn't matter. Like, well, you say that every week, and it's like you're, like you're interrupting the mojo part. Like, we <laughs> Guy, can in I, his guys. past, just we'll put up a bio and they can read it. Don't all right. Let, let her get to the question. It's not okay. like he doesn't have a past. I mean, well, what was something <laughs> that turned you off that a girl did? Once. <clears throat> Ooh. I don't know, like uh, an emotional turn off? It, it, wow, could, be, it Amy, could be anything. Amy, I think you just stumped him. Did, did I you, stump did, him? Did, did she just oh, stump you? Oh, oh, no. no. Wait, is he not getting Louis, stumped? Louis got wow. a stump dump. <laughs> Louis got stumped. No, I'll tell you what, no, like self-deprecating women. Because <laughs> I think it's garbage. Like, it's like, bitch, if I see <laughs> you, and the why are you, begun. like, dumping on yourself? Like, <laughs> that's just, you just make me look like I'm, like, an idiot or something. <laughs> <laughs> right? If you're a woman, sweat yourself. Men don't like it when you don't sweat yourself. I'm not saying, like, you know, you have to do it within a level of reason. Don't be, you know, ridiculous. What do you mean, so, sweat I mean, yourself? Like, feel good about yourself. Oh, so you're saying, like, guys don't like insecure girls, basically. Right? Uh, no, guys don't like girls that are, like, too, like, eh, like, 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 if you're a woman, don't like self-deprecation, man. Some, just pull out a dictionary and look it up. <laughs> oh, my God. Can we, can we just Google Jesus. it? Here's a like, uh, Google wait, dictionary. You know what? I kind of, but here's the thing I like out of a woman. She's got to, like, she likes to, she has to like to cuddle. And yeah. like, has to like to be accept compliments. Because me, I'm the one who just touches and cuddles and compliments all the time. Hmm. What you know what I think men want? That's why you don't get no pussy. So that's maybe, like right there, just throw maybe up you know, men <laughs> men want in the I, end. I, I've learned to keep the hands off a little bit, Louis. Right. Me, men in the end want this. All they want is this. They want June Cleaver in the kitchen and a horror in the bedroom. You know, mm-hmm. and I think that's that's all they Touché. want. Thank standing you. applause, like for real. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Seriously. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Honest to God. You want to know, and I'll tell you what, you want to know who gets the most play, and you'll never imagine it. Tell the end to play the video that says the singer video. Tell them to play that, and I'll show you so any here can see just <laughs> who gets the most play. Oh, can we do that? It's all yeah. about the money. I, 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 can, I don't know if he can do that. <laughs> yeah, he can do that. He's play. Is it? Or is he playing Angry Birds? <laughs> <laughs> I think he's playing Angry Birds. <laughs> Which video? Uh, which video did you say? The singer video. The singer video. No, it's titled "Singer." Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna we're All gonna right. okay. We're if, if, gonna if get you guys story. if you guys are watching this on camera, we, you can do that too. Uh, it's talkslamradio.com slash round two. So uh, and and eight one three six three nine talk. That's eight one three six three nine eight two five five. If you uh, want to dive in on this uh, sex talk on this Valentine's, I'm Day assuming special. he didn't play the video, right? Yeah, don't, hang yeah, on, hang now, on, Louis. Louis we're gonna. On. Yeah, we're gonna play the video, but uh, hang on a second. And or for those of you who, yeah, okay, here we go. A really heavy silence here. Wow, is anyone there? Hello? On the air. I don't know what that was. Okay, uh, I'm sorry. You're on the air. Hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. on video. Hey, we got a caller. Yeah, we got a caller. Hello, caller. You're on the air. All right, how you guys doing? My name is uh, Malaka, and I just want to <laughs> get in on Malaka. this dating advice. <laughs> so, so original on the oh, word Malaka. Oh, God. No, right, doesn't Ma- anyone have a real name? All right, Malaka, what's, what's your question? <laughs> yeah, well, uh, my advice, well, my answer to Valentine's Day is the dollhouse. Dating sucks. Stick to strippers. It's the way it goes. <laughs> well, I think I know this Malaka. 
<laughs> you know him? Yeah, I do. <laughs> no, I don't. Really. Here you go. Hang on, let me walk outside. Actually, I don't know. You don't? No, it's a 727 number. So I, I, thought I, I think I know. I think I know oh, this guy. Is, you know. We might have to get this guy in the studio one day, dude. Oh, God. Yeah, the Malacca. You don't remember the Malacca with the best picks of the football season? Hey, hey what's up, man? <laughs> How you guys doing? What's up? Good, good. Good to see you. Good, so, yeah, good. dating sucks. Yeah. <laughs> Why does dating suck for you? What do you do wrong as a Greek? What? <laughs> well, I pick my women like I pick my football teams. Oh, God. So, <laughs> he's got to have his quarterback, his running back, his yeah, defense, right. his running, yeah. you know. Uh. I'm just going to stop gambling and and just continue going to strip clubs because mm. it works better. It works better. But it, it comes does. out to almost the same. No, because I always win at both. Well, no, I don't always win at the casino. I always lose at the casino, and at least at the strip clubs, I win something, whether it's herpes or, you know. Oh, Jesus. Mingling, you won something. And the, hence the name Malaka. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Right? Oh, my God. All right, what well, I just we... wanted to give you guys a call. I'm at Ocean Prime. I'm going to finish my dinner. Oh, nice. And, uh, Ocean Prime is good. Yeah. You're just down the block from us. What's that? You're just down the way from us. Just what? You're you are... down the way from us, which yeah. is down the street from Blue Martini if we end up there later. Yeah, we... we... So, oh, yeah, we're gonna go wild. Let's go, let's go wild. Hey, Scott wants to go out and drink with us. Let's go think, wild. Like, after the show. <laughs> yeah. well, right. Oh, to go wow, do we actually have you back? Yeah, yeah. our engineer is back. Yeah, hey, right, bring the other guy, uh, bring you Brandon back. He's cool. Remember that. <laughs> Wait, uh, you Amy, go. you had a question. <laughs> No, I forgot. Uh, oh, what do we oh. think about online dating? Oh, online, online dating. dating. Yeah. Wow, online dating. If you have questions and comments about That's online dating, that can get dating, expensive, wow. though. 813 talk Are we Something? talking about, like, eHarmony? Yeah, that's for, like, 40, 50 bucks a month. Have you ever I did, into this? I, yeah, EligibleGreeks.com. <laughs> Are you serious? I wasn't, I was serious. Is that a real question? There is a is that real, that a real th thing. There's an actual website called EligibleGreeks.com. Next oh to big dick <laughs> I don't know about that <laughs> one, extra but big you know, oh I mean, there's yellow drugs. I mean, then after that, there's what? Extra big boobs dot com. Christian mingle dot com. <laughs> interracial dot com. Scott's laughing at that one. There's, you know, I, 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 I made two Facebook friends out of the eligible right. dot com. I, I have got to finish my thought on this. But one, I mean, one. I got to do that for dying free. To say this. So in, please uh, tell us, Nick. And, and all right. I, I because. Uh, in this in this town in Tampa, now I'm gonna finish my thought from what we just talked about. About being bisexual? Yeah, I have to because in this town, there's nothing but bi people in this town. Oh, I, I know people. Uh, oh yeah, I have a girlfriend. Okay, but I want to fuck you. Uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> you know, and and we just said the word. Sorry about that. Oh my god! <laughs> ow, sorry, but you know, and ow. You told me not to say that word. Now you're like, I'm saying it. All right, one once, but you know, it's like I, I we know people. Or I know people. My God, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, they're like, oh yeah, I have a girlfriend. I'm straight, but I want to, you know, but I, but I want to just experience it for one. You night. know what? You know what? Here's the thing. Here's a theory I've I've noticed a lot on the beach too. Like you see a girl. <laughs> She's a, all of a sudden she's a lesbian, and you'll say, "Why? How did you become a lesbian?" Well, I'm sick and tired of all the douchebag men's and everything like that. So she ends up with a butch douchebag, like a female douchebag. That I don't understand. Like, is it G swingers? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Is it now? Are you just are you just decided now? Okay, I'm sick of dick. Now I'm going to vagina. There's or a lot of lesbians I mean, lately. Really? And and there are straight guys who say they're straight straight. And or they just sudden, like the abuse. They, they're they're like, oh, yeah, I have a girlfriend. Oh, yeah, I'm the macho guy. But uh, one night they get drunk and then they just, you know, do you. <laughs> and I they don't. do another guy. and But they'll never talk to I don't you care. About I don't care how drunk I get. That will never happen with me. <laughs> I mean, it's just this town. I know a lot of people like that. I'm like, Jesus. I mean, if, if you are, you are. If you're not, you're not. Just be who you are. Mm. Yeah, Why gross can't you, indeed. And especially mm -hmm. in this town. Ew. Tampa, terrible. Very gross. Terrible, this town. Mm -hmm. I, I, I've been in a lot of places. Let me tell you, uh, this is the worst. You go out every single night. I don't go out every single every night. Every single I night. I do not go out every single you night. You check in on Facebook every single night at a bar. Not every single night. Every though. single night. No. 
Yes. More like every second. What are you talking about every no, second? No, that's true. I too. do not. How, you're not even on my Facebook. <laughs> nah, I see them. I like it. <laughs> really? Exactly. <laughs> Fair enough. You I, got my number, man. I don't need your Facebook. Oh, no, I'm man. saying, I, you know, I, I, I don't, not every night. Seriously, I'm in, I mean, yeah, I, I go to restaurants and I, and I drink there. You know, I, I, I extend my stay at the restaurant a little bit. You know what I mean? Oh, my God. Oh <laughs> we were at Sarah's. Ling, ling, ling. That's where we were. We were at Sarah's. Sarah's is a great place to I take a date. I love Sarah's. That's a it. great place to take a date. If it Sarah's really is. is a speakeasy. Sarah's is good. For those of you who are in Chicago, listening, Sarah's is a speakeasy place. It's We don't have that many here. Amy, it's, what do you do tomorrow? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I thought Nick was taking me out. I guess well, Nick's apparently out, you, got, no, I'm going to the freaking wing hat. Wing oh, place. yeah, you're going to the wing place. Yeah. You're going to the uh, $20 wing. The $20 wing. The Yudo yes. place. What was yeah. it called? Salem. 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 Yes. Yeah. Salem. Yes, 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 wow. Yes. Sounds more like that's Salmonella. Where <laughs> that's, that's where she's that's going. That's where I'm going tomorrow. Lucky blah, me. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what do we think about dirty talk in bed? Ooh. Dirty talk. Dirty talk in do bed. Do we like that or I, do we not like I that? I like that. Is that a turn on or a turn off? It's a turn on for me. Yeah. Yeah, hot. You really like if hot. someone's just quiet in bed like, or uh, like loud? I, I, I want you and ah, uh, you know. <laughs> really? <laughs> sometimes, I don't know. Slip, slip, I think slip. it's kind of, no, I don't know. Talk can, I don't know. It depends what's being said. I mean, if, you know. What are you looking at me like? <laughs> no, no, I'm just asking you. What, what, like, what do you like, dirty talk? What, like, uh, it depends, like, what it is. I mean, what we're talking about. I mean, like, if a girl's like, "Who's your daddy?" I'm like, "Okay, that's just dumb." It's, it's, if you like dirty talk, right? call in now eight one three six three nine talk. Actually, yeah, I want to hear what other people like oh, for dirty talk. I got, I got something. Okay, what oh, do you think like, about someone choking you? I have heard this several choking? times. Yeah, seriously, well, I don't think I bed. could ever come to choking anything. I mean, really choking, like choking. I have heard from like two or three guys that they've had a girl ask them to choke them. Really? What the heck is this? I don't know. If if you have a question on this, please like, call in eight one three six three nine. Or you have an uh, answer, or if anyone has an answer on yeah, that it, choking it, during God. sex. Can you believe? And wow. hair pulling. I mean, I don't. Well, hair And here cool. comes the crew. Ah, <laughs> we love you guys. Oh, Look there's our, there's you our know crew. What? Come on in because it's Valentine's Super Saint Valentine's Day special. We're talking about a lot of sex, just like you guys. Come on in. Come on in. <laughs> yes, come on in. Maybe where, where yeah, maybe the ladies in there. Yeah, yeah we want the ladies. In here. Maybe they can answer. Got, they can answer our questions with the uh, yeah, choking real. and the pulling and the yanking. Yeah, and the, it just uh, and the punching. And they're, they're, here they come, and they're they're, they're on their way in. Um, these are beautiful ladies that we had on our show last week. Oh, really? Yes. And uh, there are that hopefully they're coming in. There hey. she is. Oh, oh hey. there we go. Hi. Hi. High five, girl. Hi. 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 Happy Let's Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's one. Day uh, for tomorrow. So Are what are you guys up to? Already? Uh, have a seat. We're, we're, right now we <laughs> were we were talking about seat. kinky stuff. Kinky yes. stuff. Well, what like, were you guys talking about on your show? These guys have a show too. And uh, by the way, uh, welcome to round two. Uh, your I, mic, your is mic, mic is on. on. Is that mic on? It's on. Okay, we have uh, uh, other people in the studio here. Beautiful people. Thank God. Uh, thank you. But, and <laughs> as as we do. Like Amy, Amy was way, wondering Amy, over Amy, here, what's Amy up is with our choking for the next couple of shows because the two guys that were here. Or, uh, uh, before our on away Chicago, <laughs> so uh, she's amazing. Amy, these are uh, women. Women, this is Amy. <laughs> women. <laughs> we'll take it. <laughs> Point taken. There you go. All right. Once again, happy Valentine's Day, number one. And if you want to just take a look at what we're talking about here today, because it's a lot of a lot of stuff uh, going on. Um, do you are you in a relationship? No. N no. No. Um, I'm kind of. I, not. I'm not in a relationship. I'm in a uh, a mutual agreement. A mutual, mutual agreement. That's a good, that's what does that what they call mutual it? Mutual agreement. agreement. What does that mean? Um, I we we're long distance, so I fuck who I want, and he fucks who he wants, and we just tell each other about it, and then we get over. Wow, it. really? Now, wow. I mean, long distance booty yeah. call. And that is is that? I mean. I, I guess that's this day and age. I, yeah. I guess. I mean, I I love him. I do love him. And when we're closer together, we'll change it around, and things will be different. But I mm -hmm. mean, we're very open about it. We don't try to lie. We don't try to hide it. So I think that's what makes it work. Wow. Wow. That's awesome. I mean, if you can do that, a lot of people do have open relationships like that. But wow, I to to yeah, wow. <laughs> okay, I'm 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 mesmerized. But but let me ask you guys something. I I was just asking, and I. I'm dying to ask you guys. It's this town. 
I'm going to ask one thing because it's Tampa, okay? Mm -hmm. Or Trampa, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> People who say they are straight, okay? He's, Literally. He's I really mean, honest. I, I really have got to, because I, I, want, I want other opinions, and you guys are per perfect to tell me this. And then all of a sudden, they're like, oh, yeah, I'm straight. I have a girlfriend. But uh, I'm going to go out and, uh, you know, but he, they go out, they get drunk, and all of a sudden, they're with a, I mean, they, they do it with a guy. But but then they go back to their girl and they never tell them. I mean, wow. I, I mean, it's this town. I this town more than any other town I have ever been in. I've been pretty good amount of towns. My friend, <laughs> my friend tells me about this guy that she knows. He's gay and he has sex with married straight men on the regular. Exactly. That's what I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah. I'm. I think it's just this day and age. I mean, <sighs> I mean. I, if you got, if you think about it, back in the Greek times, they were doing the same thing. You okay there, Amy? <laughs> yeah, Amy's like, like oh, oh yeah, uh, poor Amy. <laughs> like, Damn it, I think that happened to me. Uh, hit it, man. Um, well, what were we talking about? The choking thing. Oh yeah, back to this. What, yeah, what's the yeah, what's the deal with women wanting to be choked? Yeah, have you ever heard of this? <laughs> have you ever heard of that? I I've mean, done it. <laughs> heard of it. <laughs> I mean, it's it's not a bad time. I mean, <laughs> you've done it's it. It's not a bad. Time. <laughs> it's not a bad time. I mean, it's just kind of. It adds to the fun. Does it? All right. Okay. I mean, so it's like it's well, it's like oh. If you have you, if you've ever heard of autoerotic asphyxiation, it's kind of the same like point. You know, it's almost like the same thing. Like if a guy chokes you, it it almost heightens the arousal to the point where you could you could come at like at, at a notice. Like I mean, it's it's like a big thing. I mean, that's why those guys like you'll see them like tie ropes around their neck and do stuff like that. Yeah, I've heard wow. about that too. That's yeah. like I mean, that's, that's, weird too. It brings you to your it brings you to your climax play. And I I mean I don't I don't yeah, I don't think of it as weird. I mean whatever gets you off. I mean everyone has different sexual desires, you know. Yeah, uh, yeah that's true. That's that true. is very true. I was just wondering. I've heard this a few times from guys and I never heard of it Personal before. Experience? But no <laughs> I have never been choked. <laughs> wow. I'm just asking <laughs> no, and that's the thing. Like, I I don't knock anything till I try it. Minus what we talked about today, feces or urine or anything like that. Like, obviously, that's not the question for me. <laughs> yeah, don't and, be on me. Yeah, if, if you want that, find someone else that likes that. But I mean, in my experience, I like if someone wants you know wants to try something, I'll try it, and maybe I'll like it. Maybe I'll take that on to the next person. And be like, hey, listen, do this now. I mean, it just it's just she comes up with the direction. <laughs> yeah. Boom! I like. See, I love you. You're awesome. <laughs> I, yeah, last time you were awesome, and you come in here and you're rocking it. Well, just like that. I love you. You're fabulous. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. It is Valentine's Day. Water's it is. In the air. You. Are, oh. I, now you have a date for tomorrow. No, oh. I work. A date with work. Yeah, a date with oh. work. My, oh, me my, too. My first love. <laughs> How about you? We got, call call. We, we got a caller. We got a caller. Caller, call. Uh -huh. Let us know here what you we go. got. Uh, okay. Uh, caller, call you're on the air. Here. Round two. Go ahead. Hi, is uh, George there? George this is says... here. <laughs> George. Yes. You can't come with Mackie, sir. So. Gala. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, next caller. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. Thank you, you for. Uh, yes. Thank you for that. Because I don't even know what he was saying. Oh, okay. Oh. Nope. Okay. Didn't cut him off. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, Scott. <laughs> Scott's our engineer. He's awesome. <laughs> We've had a lot of callers tonight. We have. Yeah, and you know what? It's so funny. Just because people are not calling in doesn't mean they're not listening. Because we've got like a huge audience out there tonight, from Chicago to here to all the way in California. So uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty fun tonight. <laughs> you need to send us some of your viewers. Well, yeah, <laughs> we do. <laughs> we had the same caller twice, and it was some guy I fucked before. Oh, oh my god! Yeah, are you serious? Yeah, yeah, no, really? yeah. He was just, like asking like, and he he was horrible, and it was just, like he's like acting like I don't know him. I look at the number, I'm like looking at them, I'm like this is him, and they're like, oh gosh, and he's psycho as fuck anyway. So it's just like, <laughs> of course you'd call my show. <laughs> oh my god! And want to talk about sex? You, you, of course. You know who I want opinion from tonight? I want Scott's opinion. I don't know a lot of things tonight. Him. Scott, like, out of everything what? that we've talked about tonight, what's, uh, do you have a girlfriend? Yes. Ah, yes. <laughs> and uh, your, your, your relationship, are you taking her out tomorrow night? <laughs> no. Why? <laughs> Why not? Because she hates going out on Valentine's. It's so busy. She's oh, like, so you're just going to stay in and fuck her. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> stay romantic. Yeah. yeah. Oh my you're God. so romantic. No, but uh, you're going <laughs> <dinner. laughs> to stay in and just do your thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's sweet. Like, what? What? Do you have anything special planned? <laughs> like, well, I don't want to like, say. Oh, you can't air. say. Oh, yeah, I oh. mean, you don't want him to ruin the surprise, dude. No, no. 
Uh, Scott's cool. He's he's one of the best. Yes. <laughs> I'm, I'm so sorry. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what? What did he say? I don't know. I don't know what you said. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> How about Alrighty. gerbils in the ass? That was like, I heard Richard Gere. Gerbils said, in the ass. <laughs> <laughs> gerbils in the That's ass? I don't know about what? that. I heard, I heard like <laughs> Richard Gere like gerbils what? in his ass. I need a drink. Not Mark, not too. Maker's Mark because they're watered down now. But <laughs> I need something else. <laughs> Are you buying me a drink for that? Obviously. Oh, yes. <laughs> I need it. Are you Trust buying me. us all a drink? <laughs> yes. We, we all need drinks. <laughs> we all need drinks. <laughs> show. My, my show is actually, uh, I think next week we're incorporporating wine. What? Are really? You? We're Can gonna we... we're gonna have to start. We're gonna have we to gotta combine drunk. our shows together during the time that these guys are gone. <laughs> we're like, oh, we're going back and forth between the shows. Yeah. We'll That'll get drunk. We'll take shots, shots between shows. That's <laughs> shots, shots, right shots, right shots, that sounds shots, like shots, a good shots, idea. Yeah. Yeah. Even idea. Scott agrees. Yeah, sh- shots like shots totally like shots. That. Do you want to uh, get involved? Yeah. Is that why you agree? Yes. Ah, yeah, uh, like, Scott wants to get involved. That's awesome. Gotcha. Yeah. Shots between shows. <laughs> He's like, I'll be right back. I'm just going to go next door and take a shot right Yeah. Now. We need a I shot. thought we I couldn't gotta... drink in here. Now we can. <laughs> now you tell me. Now. <laughs> you just can't use a real cup. Yeah. Yeah. Just can't use a real cup. <laughs> I told you you can do that. <laughs> really. <laughs> they they hate coffee too. Cups. How do you think they, they get really past this whole you. show? I don't know. I mean, we. You could have put some Baileys in that. That's, thank you. That's what I wanted to do, but he wouldn't let me stop. What? Baileys. Yeah. Honestly. Uh, yeah. Really? Did I not say yes, Baileys? You said it like a hundred times. What's wrong? Exactly. With, hey, we got ourselves another caller. Please be appropriate. Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, caller, go ahead. Hello. You're on the air. We're on to. Yes, am I in the radio? Hey, you yes, are you on are. the air. Yes, am I in the radio? Yes. Yes, I, I hear this talk. Uh, you say uh, the men they sleep with the men, and this is very unusual for you. And I, 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 it's very unusual for me. Why do you talk this? Why not talk with, with women and, and the men? And I don't understand this. I come to this country uh, a couple of years ago, and I see this. It's just okay for you people. I, I don't know why. Why is it okay? Uh, that's a good question. Tremendously with men. I mean, yeah. I hear all these, the gay marriage, and, and it's okay, and the, 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 the gays, they, they, they uh, how yeah. you say, they, they adopt their children, and it's just not right, this is not, <laughs> it's not the right way. But did you come to America because we have free, like, the ability to have freedom? Is that why you came? Well, um, we got to I, 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 I come to America because uh, I have... Caller, you're on the air. Yeah, what's up with this guy, man? He's the worst thing <laughs> I've ever heard of. Ah, it's Louie. It's Louie. Yeah, it's all right. 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 It's yeah, I come to this country and I get two kids and uh, what the country? Oh, yes, you must. Sound like guys. Borat, you know? Oh yeah, my should God. Yeah, really. Where did right. you come from? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, oh, ah, that's funny. God. That's funny. All right, Louis, what's up? Where are There's you? Nothing up. I'm not. Uh, I miss you. Well, I don't know. What's, you ask the women. Oh, oh you know what? Bentley misses you. Yeah, she, she, she misses you. Right? you. Yeah, you did. Uh, yeah. I'll see you. <laughs> What are those unusual words? What do you think of uh, George over there? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> He's my Valentine. Yes, we are. I, he really would like to be, too. And so I'll say that on the air in front of everybody so that he's no longer embarrassed. Go ahead and accept. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh my Don't worry. God. We're not going to go for $20 chicken wings. You can go to Blue Martini, right? Yeah. yeah go Blue Martini. She, Amy, Amy got asked out on a date, and the guy I was. I heard that. He's a twenty dollars max. <laughs> twenty dollars <laughs> max. Who said that? On Valentine's Day, the hot, the, the no, lowest on, on Valentine's Day. Apparently, they're, they're, they're Florida on rednecks. On any day, <laughs> <laughs> on any day, you should never I mean, ever yeah. say that to a girl. Twenty dollars. That's yes. like an instant. I'll just pay for my fucking self at that point. Yeah, yeah. right. Exactly. Like I'll just go out by myself. I'd rather max out my credit card thing. Right. Oh my god, guys. What are you do? That's Pretty funny. <laughs> we, <laughs> talked, we talked about that today, too, though, like the awkwardness of dating, because everyone's just trying to fuck at the end of the day. <laughs> you're exactly. Not really, exactly. You're not really trying to get to know someone. You just right. want what you want. Exactly. Well, George wants that, but he'll do it afterwards. That's why yeah. he's yeah. 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 Fun, man. <laughs> gotta be, it's got to be fun. No, you I mean, want a relationship, don't you? He just, he has yeah, I could too, go for you know? a relationship. He likes the cuddle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
Scott, you, you like to come? Ten minutes ago, you would have heard that. <laughs> well, how, oh, how did I get brought into this? Ah, uh, you. Hey, do. but uh, you take like the blue little... martini first. That's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Do you have a man crush on Scott? No. 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 You sure? You sure? <laughs> He'll be sleeping with you, and then Scott on the side. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> we are in Tampa. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we, we are. are in Tampa. <laughs> <laughs> are you okay oh with that, God. Scott? Blue Martini? <laughs> That's all I heard. Blue Martini. That's all I heard. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, my God. Are exactly. you buying his drink? <laughs> yeah, obviously. Mm. Scott, he's, you got to buy her for your drinks. Nice. That means you have to put out. Exactly. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Dirty little... I'll Gentlemen, we're going to leave you. Oh, all, right. all right. Lovely oh. girls are leaving right. us. Thanks for yes. joining Thank us. Thank you for joining us again. You guys are great. See ya. We'll see you next week. See you, they see you next week. Out. How great is that, right? Wait, what? We'll, we'll see you, you over sorry? at Blue Martini. Yeah. Louis, I'm sorry. You said something? Uh, they yeah, they kicked themselves out. Good job, George. See what happens when you fart like that. <laughs> oh, my God. Dude, I'm trying to be professional, okay? <laughs> This yeah. is not about being professional. That's what. Yeah. Never mind. It's okay. That's we got a, ten more. We got ten more minutes. Yeah, anyways. we got ten more minutes. <laughs> right. I don't think she'll be able to run far with them heels. All right. If you have That's a uh, life story. if you have a story <laughs> you want to share, uh, this is Valentine's Day special. What is it, Louis? Say it. Super Saint Valentine's Day special. Exactly. <laughs> two, <laughs> two for one. <laughs> it's two for one. If you have a story and it's a two for one or a three for one or whatever, just call in 813 oh You know, I want to hear, I want to hear like a caller like who's just like recently been married or has been married at least a year. Yeah. Where are callers and see at? that. Yeah. And just uh, people are listening. Yes. They're just afraid to call in. You know, you can't email well, us now, pre- by the way. You can email us at round two show at gmail.com. So in case you can email, yeah. Uh, yeah, just uh, email once again, round two show. Maybe they're getting at scared gmail. off by com. some of the like the, some of the callers that we're getting over here. I know, right? That's some a, foreigner mm-hmm. doesn't even, a, yeah. know, some right? foreigner who doesn't some speak foreigner. any English <laughs> and he's like sounds like he's Borat or what about threesomes? Oh, there we go. Uh, uh, let's threesomes, take a call. threesomes, threesomes, threesomes. No, uh, no, we got a caller. We got a caller, uh, and uh, caller, you're on the air. Nicholas, I got to tell you, man, I'm proud of you tonight. You're holding down the fort without your two wingmen. Ah, look who it is. You know who this is? This is Comcast Sports anchor uh, Drew Filios. <laughs> Do you work for Comcast or you work for Fox Sports Net? Well, actually, it's, that's Bright House Sports Bright House. Network. That's Nicholas. what I keep seeing. Yeah, yeah, you guys see. suck at giving props, I swear to God. <laughs> hey, I, when he kept saying, listen, I'm, I'm from Chicago. Uh, and there is no Comcast down here. <laughs> And, you know, uh, Drew, uh, quick question uh, before we get out of this whole thing. I, I, I really need to ask you a question. Drew, are you still there? What's up? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I need to ask you, what is going on with Comcast? That's a good question. Um, uh, I think Comcast, yeah. they bought up all the NBCs. They, they, they've they merged with NBC, right? Uh, yeah, they yeah. did. And uh, is, does that affect you in any way? No, no, that, 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 that does not affect me. It does not affect me. Nick, there's more important things to talk about. It's Valentine's Day tomorrow, my friend. Come on now. No, real quick, real quick. One more thing, Drew. It says here, yeah, it's, well, wait a minute, real quick. It says here, $16.7 billion deal. Well, it's, but right now, Bright House, all the Bright House entities are, are alive and well, Nicholas. Yeah. Uh, Comcast and NBC, that's a totally different story but bright right. house is standing strong right now is it bright house part of like time you know Warner what? or it, something it, it, now not, you know yeah. nbc i i yeah. worked i worked for nbc once and let me tell you something i will never work for them again nbc stands for never believe your contract which is true <laughs> and now i'll never work for them again that's why comcast <laughs> owns them <laughs> So, Nicholas, I have to ask, who's the lovely lady to your right? Ah, uh, here we go. Yeah. Now we get back yeah. into it. All right. So, um, the lovely lady to my... We have another uh, call. We have another call. Hey, okay, ne- hang on, Drew. Drew, Don't we'll move. put you on hold. Don't okay. move. Okay, okay. Don't move. Whatever you do. Um, okay, hello, caller. You're on the air. Hey, how you doing? My Good. first time watching this show, and I really enjoyed it. Thank you. Uh, and I want to say, uh, George, you did a great job tonight. Thank uh, you. Thank you. A big shout out to you. Uh, I'll be tuning to your show every week. Uh, you guys do a real good job. But I also want to do one more thing. I want to do a shout out to my wife for Valentine's Day. Oh, there you go. I, See, final. I love her so much. <gasps> uh, so sweet. You know, I'm in love with her even more today than I was yesterday. Um, 
you know, even the sheer fact that, you know, she hits me and all that doesn't really matter. <laughs> is, is she wow. Greek? It, it, wow. Well, you know, she's Greek, but I've, I've dropped all the battery assault charges on her. Oh, did you? Oh and uh, I just want to like say related I love to you, me Sophia, or so much. And uh, we love, uh, I love her cousin, George Serentopoulos. He's such a good guy. This is yeah. This is my by the way, my cousin Bill. Oh, okay. okay <laughs> He's wow. married to my cousin Sophia, uh, which yeah. is greatest. She's very lucky to be married to me. Let me tell you yes. that right now. Uh, He's very confident oh. with that very too. Nice. And, and no, I believe I I'm believe, the lucky one. Let's be honest. I believe they're both lucky. Anyways, no, well, I am. I love you guys, and I love my wife so much with all my heart. All right, thanks, Bill. Right, thanks, Bill. All right, we'll all right. talk to you. All right, Drew, are you still there? Here. All right. All now, right. getting back to your question, um, the lovely lady to my left, actually, to your right, uh, <laughs> is Amy Geo. Amy, um, say hello to Drew. Hi. <laughs> Drew. Hello. What's up? Are you there? Yeah, okay. What's yeah. up? Okay, we thought we lost you. She said hi. Awesome. Now, now who, who's the gentleman on the other side of Nicholas? Uh, that is George. George is the newcomer. George and, shut up. Uh, he is our fill-in for tonight because Joe never showed up. <laughs> oh, really? Uh, all right. Well, guys, I just want to say it's been uh, – I've been listening to you guys for like the last three, five minutes, also watching you, and uh, you, you guys are doing a good job. Right, How long you. is Amy going to be with you guys now, the next <laughs> couple of weeks? Or Yeah, she'll be here the next couple of weeks because uh, those two uh, wonderful people who we work with are on vacation. Beautiful. Well, I will say that I don't miss them because she's much better looking than they are. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I think you, you hear that, Louie? I appreciate that. I, I think you just found a permanent spot, Amy. Oh, sweet. <laughs> and, and, Free and drinks. I, I guess Naso is out and Louie is still in, though. We have to have Louie. <laughs> okay, awesome. Are you sure? I'm down. Because I think I could replace Louie. But then again, I think uh, I'm already a permanent no one member can of the show. replace Louie. That's Louis, true. Uh, Louie's the fixture. <laughs> He's a fixture. He is. He's a fixture right here. He he and I started. That or he gets stuck in the chair and he just can't. He won't leave. No, <laughs> <laughs> that's not nice. Oh, shit. Not a Valentine's Day. All right, all right. Oh, oh, man. Well, well, we, well, well, guys, thank you, thank you for having me hey, on. Drew, Yo, have you, a great you, night and a happy Drew, Valentine's Day. Let me ask you too, something, okay? are you, Drew. Are you? Do you want to ask Amy out for tomorrow? Oh, because the other guy just wants oh. to give her twenty twenty dollars. But uh, I know. Uh, What's up with that? Yeah, but but, but I mean, there you're the most romantic the guy I know. Why don't There's you? There's a fly uh, on the camera. There is a fly on the camera. Um, why? Why is? Uh, where there would must you be a bed home in. <laughs> take is her it? out. No, I'm because kidding. You know what? A you're Amy taking needs taking me out. Wait, 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 wait. Why are you because like? He is a sports anchor with oh, with uh, Comcast. Okay. That's what. And he Bright House, you goon. Whatever. Comcast. And, Right go house, back to sorry. Chicago, man. If you can't get the Tampa stuff right, right. It's really. Uh, I can definitely. Uh, I'll definitely do better than twenty bucks at the wing house. Uh, I think, okay. any, oh, I think anyone can. Okay, so so you would take her out. Uh, I I don't want to embarrass her right now on on live radio, but oh, uh, man. but uh, absolutely, 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 yeah, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Scott just came in and he's like, he's, 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 uh, there's a fly on the camera. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that before. It's like, what the hell is it? It's right there. I but, see uh, it. Right in the middle. It's still there, actually. But, <laughs> yeah. uh, I'll it's let you guys corner. know. Great, great job tonight, Nicholas. Your we'll talk to you. Oh, we, we, we love it. That's hilarious. All right, Drew, thanks very much. Dude from Bright well, House Sports Network. Yeah, we have an... Excuse me. And uh, he's one of the best sports anchors around. Finally here, got right. it right. And he, he should go to a real network. All right. No, <laughs> oh, we got another caller. We have another caller. Uh, uh, hello, caller. You're on the air. Caller, you're on the air. Yeah, uh, my name is Mario. I'm just calling. Um, just wanted to say um, uh, I'm really, really fortunate that I got to see balls on a fly. You know, it's the first experience. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Um, but great show. Um, love George and Louie. Good folks. And, um, you know, I'll start being watching you guys. Oh, All thank right. You thank you. Much. And, uh, yeah, uh, where are you calling from tonight? Uh, Clearwater Beach. Woo oh, nice. CB. Wow. Clearwater <laughs> Beach. Nice. Uh, you know what? I was, I was there over the weekend. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Yeah. We went oh, yeah. Saturday night. 
Yeah. We went Where to, at uh, Shepherds? I went to Palm Pavilion, and then we went to uh, where the heck did we go? I, uh, Brown Boxer. Brown Boxer. You know, right. Brown Boxer is phenomenal. They're and opening. Uh, you know what? They're actually opening up a Brown Boxer by my near my house. Really? Right off of here? US 19 and Enterprise. Brown Boxer is, is awesome it? in Clearwater. That's where it's all. It's like one of the coolest like, bars to go yeah, to. Yeah, a lot of people in Hyde Park. <laughs> Uh, yeah, well, this is about the only thing to do around minutes. here: brown boxer, pavilion, yeah. and play shuffleboard with the yeah. geriatric ward in the sea block. Mario on the air. Yeah. We have 15 more minutes. Yeah. Like, wow, well, we have 15 more minutes, guys. So we we yeah we, we, we can, are gonna fill Mario, in you can you can fill hey, in if you want. Yeah. You know. Do what? Well, you could mm-hmm. fill in. It's Valentine's Day. What do you, yeah. you got? Any uh, dates for this weekend or what? Yeah, it's called my left hand. Oh man. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, you get, oh yeah. Ah, lefty. What are you left-handed? Yes, sir. Yeah. See, no, but I'm not going to do anything. I'm just going to be the cheap date and just <laughs> get myself a, a meal Finally and a drink myself a whole bottle and not share you know with what? anybody. Why do you have a wedding ring on, by the way? Yeah, by the way, Nick, wait. Huh? Why do you have a well, wedding Mario, ring on? Well, Mario, maybe me and you will really? pound them on, on, on the I, weekend. I can't talk about that. Not on the oh, air. No, I, I do have a wedding ring on, but I can't talk about that on the oh, air. Because that person hmm. might be listening. Oh, oh, okay. Never mind. Sorry. Sorry. Anyway. Um, is it, Aww, is that like a finger so song, like a, a, a pan? A what? What? What do you say? <laughs> like, I don't know. What do you say, Kane? Hey, what are you, speaking jive? <laughs> what was your question? <laughs> like a tan under the ring. Yeah, you got a tan line under your ring? Mm-hmm. Uh, I, 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 that or his finger got so fat he can't no, get it off. Oh. I do, I do. I do. <laughs> you know what, I, I, I can't, get some I can't on talk that. about this. <laughs> Why not? Nick's a little shy wrong? when it comes to his relationship no, no, status. Please, please. I'm no, single. Anyway. I'm eligible. Yes. Do we have any dates for our friend over here? I'm a Libra. Yeah. Oh, if are any you? Women I'm a Libra. Dates. Oh my God. Libras are women's the best. Out there. October second. George needs women's. Really? <laughs> women's. October eighteenth. Oh, I'm, mm-hmm. I'm seventeen days older. Yeah. Well, yeah. You no, know I'm what? Half huh? What? I'm half centaur. He's oh. half centaur. Centaur. Taurus. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> did I get it right, Taurus? Did, 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 uh, did, uh, George is my translator, so I want to thank him for <laughs> translating everything that I've been saying. Uh. <laughs> By the way, this is Mario Paredes, my best friend in Clearwater oh, Beach. Oh, yes. Okay, wow. okay. So, good friends. Good friends. Good friends, good times, good friends indeed. Yes. Yeah. Anyways, I, guys, thank you for taking my call. Thank you. Uh, thank thank you, you for watching. calling in. Thank you. And, uh, mm. yeah, that's that's very nice. Uh, okay, if, if we have about five, okay, then or 10, again, actually 10 minutes left now. Uh, I've been corrected. I'll, that was I'll tell you what, If you guys have your stories <laughs> really quick and uh, you want to call news. in 813 639 8255, that is the number to call. Um, yeah, this is our last what 10 minutes, and yes. we're still on the air. That's great. That is great. Uh-huh. That's so much fun <laughs> Scott tonight. Scott gave us 10 minutes of airtime. He loves us. He loves us. You he know how us. hard it is to get 10 minutes of airtime for anything. <laughs> Not when I'm freezing. Oh. <laughs> there you go. Well, then I like dr- your show. Nick's wow. buying drinks tonight, then. Oh, yes. oh yeah. Take out the Amex card. <laughs> He's it. got the Amex. Drinks <laughs> on out. you tonight. Look out. <laughs> <laughs> Scott's like already. Wait, where, where, is your girlfriend coming to join us? Uh, When we going? Tonight? tonight? <clears throat> uh, no. She's probably sleeping. Oh, boo. Oh. Mm. Oh, okay, so she's sleeping, but you're going to go out. <clears throat> Uh, this phone know. won't stop ringing. And and you know what? Uh, we'll that's we'll great. talk off air. Yeah, we'll talk off air. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I think you have a man crush. I don't. I think Jesus. you do. <laughs> I think you do. Nah, he just loves me. Oh, you're coming too. <laughs> oh, I found I'm out. coming. See that? He's got a yep. crush on I'm you, you, sweetie pie. I'm not. I'm not going. <laughs> oh yes. You are. Way to go, Nick. If we have to off. drag you Mm-mm. to Blue Martini tonight, you're going. <laughs> Come on, Amy. Drink, drink on me tonight. I'll buy you a drink. Oh, mm-hmm. see that? Mm-hmm. George will buy you a drinky yeah. poo. Drink you. Did I say drinky so poo? Sweet. Drinky uh, poo, yeah. <laughs> she, drink might want, she might want me to be her and date Let me tomorrow. tell you, I have drank, I have drunk, dr- drink. Dr- drink, drunk, drink, drunk. Exactly, drunk. whatever. Just with drink. this woman. And she is so much fun to drink with. I am. She, you are a hoot to be out I with. Am. You really are. Thank you. Uh, no, because we, we partied for <gasps> Remember one New Year's Eve? week. <gasps> Remember New Year's Eve? Uh, yes, I do. A certain someone wouldn't let us in. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> a that certain, was a blast. Somebody wouldn't let us in my own apartment. And, yeah, and we I had can't to believe like, you let yeah, that go on. That's because he was, yeah, well. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we can't talk about that. <laughs> no, we can't talk about that. <laughs> oh, God. That was an interesting New Year's Eve. What year was that? I don't know. I was skinny back then. <laughs> oh, my I'm like, God. Ah. You're so That's, fat right now. No, thank you. <laughs> no, no, but I, I, okay. I challenge, used to be skinny. <laughs> challenge now for me and for all my, all listeners out there, listen, I'm, I, by the middle of this, well, three months, I'm going to give it three months. I'm going to go down from 190 that I am right now to 140. And that's, that's too, way too skinny. No, for you. because you're 190. No. Yeah. Damn. I'm... Dude, <laughs> you do not need to lose. No. Yeah. No. I did it one year. I did it three years ago. I look great. I mean, <laughs> I look great. great. And you know what? Uh, some A certain someone noticed it. Oh, so. my God. You know who that someone is? It wasn't me. You are obsessed. Uh, I'm not. We have a caller. Oh, we got a caller. Yay, uh, let's caller, take that call. Caller, yeah. caller. Okay. Uh, caller, hello. You're on the air. Round two. Uh, am I on the air right now? Yes, yes you, you are. are. All right. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? What's going on with you? You have a story to share on Valentine's Day? Oh, it's, is there a delay? I think so. <laughs> yeah, I, I hear a delay. Yeah, can you turn down the volume? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get away. Uh, Bumper G! What's up, man? How do I do that? <laughs> all right, now I can hear. Okay. Um, all right, two questions. One, Amy, best way to an Italian girl's heart. <laughs> two, George, <laughs> history of marriage. When did it start, <laughs> and do you think it'll be here in another 100 years? I think the history wow. started. Love the show. I think it started with Adam and Eve. awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then, yeah, okay. So, Amy, a good way to <laughs> Italian girl's heart. Hmm, if you're a good cook. Can you cook? I can. I can cook. Yeah? I can cook. What's your best oh, dish? I can't. What am I saying? You can't cook. <laughs> well, I, can I, cook. I, I, can, I grill good. I grill? I can grill. <laughs> uh, grill master. Uh, I'm Greek Sicilian. I can't cook. Can you cook lasagna? <laughs> Hell no. No, that's like the easiest dish. I can. Come on. Come on. You can do it. <laughs> you can do it. I can learn. You can learn. As long as you can learn. Can learn. Amy will help you. A- Amy, Amy will actually right. As long as you're willing teach to you. learn Amy how will, to cook. Amy think, will teach I you. I think Amy wants to be taught. <laughs> <laughs> I know how to cook. Ooh. You yes. guys in the kitchen. Very well. Uh, yeah. Isn't Ooh. that why you date an Italian girl? Oh, they can cook? Oh. I would date an Italian girl because she can cook. My friend's married to an Italian girl. Man, she can she cook. Really? <laughs> Didn't you say I wasn't Italian, though? You're Sicilian. Sorry. Yeah. There's yeah. a right, difference right. between oh. Sicilian and Sicilian Italian. Sicilian and Italian. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, okay. There is a difference. This is Nicholas. What there the, is a difference what is between the difference? Sicilian I was, and Italian. It, yeah, I, I didn't a, know that. I have I a lot of Italian friends at home. Sicilians are more, like, uh, passionate about... Uh, so are Italians, but... Same shit, Sicilians dude. Sicilians are... No, <laughs> Sicilians are, like... Like very, uh, you know, mafia type. Oh, I'm mafia gonna kill type. you if what? you don't eat this. Oh, uh, come this on. is the best marinara sauce I ever had. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I <laughs> think my friend Agostino might disagree with that one. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that. Mm. What's well, the hey, best? Hey, you guys are doing a good job. I love the show. Marinara. Papa G, love you, brother. Thank Mario, you. love you. Uh, <laughs> you guys, take it easy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I want to know guys. about that history. I yeah. will. I will. <laughs> we'll find the, the, you know, the marriage question, is it going to be here in yeah. another hundred years? Yeah. What is I your opinion so. on that? Oh, yeah. Is it going to be here? The marriage question? Yeah. Yeah. If, if marriage is still going to be like, it's going to be like, I basically, don't think, I, think, I don't think so. You know what? Yeah. There might, that's I a good debate. So. And probably not. Good. man. I don't think so. I mean, the way. Is it kind of. If it, is, is it kind of a tradition that's dying out? Yeah, it's not I sacred like it no, used to be, if you think about it. I mean, all. there's just breaks and marriages all the time. <laughs> People have a fight, they yeah. get a divorce. Yeah. Scott, Scott it's, wants, it's easier Scott to get, wants to it's, chime it's in like on this. It's like the uh, gays want the marriage, but the yeah. straights don't. <laughs> exactly. Like the straights uh, don't want <laughs> it anymore, straight. so the gays are like, all right, we'll take it then. I'm like, dude, have it. You'll see how miserable you'll be. <laughs> not that I would know. I've never been married, but I mean, I don't. Uh, <laughs> I would say gay guys cheat more. All right, more. Joe. Take yeah. it easy. All right, okay. thank you. Right. Thank you. Gay, gay guys but. do cheat more, but yeah. there are some out there who are monogamous. Some. Yeah, but some. gay guys can't reproduce unless they're with a girl. <laughs> Scott, you want to chime in on this? Nope. No. <laughs> do you want to get? Do you want to get married, Scott? No. 
I don't know. I don't know. You don't know? I don't know. Man. I mean, These if I meet guys. a girl, the the one thing I would have to say, obviously, just you know, you got to be respectful of my t- traditions, my culture, my family. I mean, it's it doesn't seem like it's asks a lot, but you know, I mean, sometimes I've seen it where like Greeks married non Greeks, and there's just a conflict between because of the traditions. Like the wife doesn't like what the Greeks do, and this and that, and there's like. <laughs> Usually that's all I say. I mean, you know, my like my mother, she she's very religious, and right. and that's it. That's and all I would say and is just respect that. Respect that is right. I mean, it's and, gotta you know, be about respect. I think you just gotta be best friends with whoever. Yeah, you picked. that too. I yeah. mean, you just gotta be best friends. Definitely. By by all means. <laughs> and I, I trust. Just, yeah. Ah, uh, well, that's 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 the biggest. Thing. That's easier said than done. Uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean, I can sit here and stand the air. I'm, I'm trustworthy. All right, gentlemen and and lady. We Not have that I'm five. trying to do a shout out. We have, we have, a, a we, have a, we, we have our last five minutes, so uh, we have to wrap this up. But before we do that, if you have a really quick comment or question, eight one three six three nine eight two five five. What? Stuck to the chair. Are you stuck to the? Chair? Yeah, I'm stuck to it. Too. I thought we. Oh hey, Scott. I thought we uh, agreed last week that we were going to switch these chairs out. Uh, oh, Rob, these trees, these chairs are good, man. They're not. No, I mean, I, what happened to the swivel <laughs> chairs? The nice ones, office ones. Can we steal them from the offices around here? Let's go for it. It's late <laughs> yeah, at night. seriously, honestly, we I just really get, like, go a for big it. Bed Connect and lay on the bed. These chairs, I cannot sit. What about in these chairs. like a big bed, like a big fluffy bed, and just lay on it? I'd like that. Better. Can we just you get the swivel chairs and get over radio? <laughs> what? Yes. Amy, I like the cuddle. You know that, right? I, wow, I did she hear wants you say that. I, yeah. <laughs> so we got a bed in here, you know. You know. <laughs> yeah, we all have to cuddle together. <laughs> do you know what would happen on these shows if we had beds? Uh huh. I could imagine. <laughs> I, I could. Only Louis would imagine. snore so loud we wouldn't even be able to hear ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, did you ever hear? Did you? Ever, God forbid, when he gets drunk and you ever uh, hear oh. him throw up. He Ew. goes like, oh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> that's hilarious. It, it I is believe the funniest. it. I believe it. I honestly, God, Louis is the best when it comes to. <laughs> if you're out drinking with him, I used to live at a place called Echelon at the Reserve, and there was this huge place out in the field. And he's like, I'll be right back. I have to throw up. I'm like, go to your spot. And he would. And he <laughs> 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 like, disgusting. Thanks for sharing. That. Sorry. Yeah. Really funny. Thanks, Nick. Yeah, thanks. You can always rely thoughts. on you to share. Appreciate that. Share things we don't need to talk about. <laughs> thanks. <laughs> Oh, you got a lot of I like how I finally figured out a good spot for my microphone. Yeah. I know. And now all of a sudden, it's like it's two minutes. It's time to go. <laughs> it's like so time sad. Four, four minutes. I'm sorry. I mean, he, keeps, he keeps giving us four minutes. Yeah, I, I think he likes him. this. I, I think he likes you do him. love him. As long as keep it in the angle, it doesn't no, look inappropriate. No, one of us. No. He loves you. We, we, we all love him. Everybody loves everybody. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Thank God. <laughs> we just need one big bed and some alcohol. We'll be good. You're right. We got to do that. Next week, we'll do that. See, you want to bring alcohol in here. Yeah. And I want to bring a bet. That's okay. not a good combination. It is bring, a good combination. Bring lady friends. <laughs> and lady friends. Lots of ladies. Wait a friends. second. You have a girlfriend. I know, but if I'm I don't. You're watching. Oh. Amy, oh I don't. <laughs> Are we going to make him? That's can, true. Okay. Before this Valentine's Day special ends, we had no strippers. So That's would you like right. to strip? Uh, no, I'll pass. No? Maybe next time. What is this? When we bring the it's like the Howard Stern show. We, we need to get up. And... You never know when I have tequila. Yeah, I know you. When I have tequila. <laughs> Drink. Tequila. Oh, I'm in love with the stripper. <laughs> I'm in love with the stripper. The stripper's in love with me. I don't know. Uh, I, I never heard of that song. You are crazy. I'm ready for a drink. I'm I, I, I totally. I think, yeah. And Mr. Engineer, how long do we have? <laughs> we have no more calls. I'm um, upset. Three minutes. Three minutes. Well, about three two minutes. minutes. All right, we got <laughs> two minutes. Any any last any callers? Last callers. Any shout last callers. Eight one three six three nine. Talk. That's uh, eight. You know what? We need talk. we need some shout outs. We got a shout yeah. out for me. Or email. Nick. Wait a minute. Real quick. Email us at uh, round two show at gmail. I didn't tell any of my friends to watch the show today. Uh, you know, you know who week. deserves a shout out? The lovely actually. Amy. Now, how I do you feel now? I was very afraid. How do you feel now? Because good. Dude, I sent a shout out to my part of the radio show and then my phone blew up. Yeah. All right. See that? She'll tell everybody to watch when we have the bed. <laughs> exactly. Oh, when we get the bed and the exactly. alcohol. Exactly. Definitely. Definitely. Next week, right? I think next week is going to be um, next week. another sex What are we going to talk about? Yes. Bed, beds and alcohol. Beds and alcohol? <laughs> beds and alcohol. Mm, two and, hours and, of that? Uh, yeah. And then we get to like. What about two minutes? You know anyone like that? 
Oh, yeah, I do, actually. <laughs> actually, so do you. We know the same person who will come in two months. That's a whole other oh story. <laughs> well, I could do a quick shout-out to my friend DJ Frankie Fiore back home. Oh Thanks for God. chiming in, George. I needed that. No, no problem. <laughs> so, anything to change the subject. So, I mean... Uh, Scott's like, yeah, you know, okay, whatever. You know, actually, I wish... <laughs> My friend Frankie should give me some advice on how to Two pick up uh, Italian Sicilian women. Oh yeah, How's yeah. That? That's funny though. I mean, <laughs> Frankie, this girl's beautiful. There he is. <laughs> oh jeez. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, that's funny. Mills. How are we doing, Scott? <laughs> Thinking out loud. Um, that's it. That's it. All right. All right. That's okay. Before we leave you, we just want to say thank you to Amy, Amy Gio, who is going to fill in for the next couple weeks yes. when those two are on vacation, and George. Thank you very much as well. Anytime. And we are, well, that's it. I'm Nicholas Anastas, and we're out of here. We'll see you next week and hit, talk to you next week. Hit the right music. Here around too. And uh, we're off to the bars. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>